Hi, everybody. We're about to go through uh, all this jewelry, so I've worked out a plan. <laughs> I've worked out a plan uh, to somehow make this go smoother. And I think what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to sort all the rings, I'm going to sort all the bracelets, I'm going to sort the necklaces, and then we're going to make sure that so many of each piece goes into each bag, right? And I'll do the same thing with tie clips and, and cuff links and all that. So that's my plan. And I set up a second table over here because my grandfather's desk that's sitting in front of me is full of crap. Hi, Yavi. So I'm gonna be looking over this way. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try and keep up with chat. But if I miss anything that you say, say it again, please. Please, please. Don't let me miss something. Oh, and I have a question. Hi, country. Hi, Kecko. Check this out. You guys see what this is? These are from a Linderwald Fine Jewelers. You see that? They're registered. They're all one and two carat. Um, so I looked those up today. Hi, Sleek. Um, they sell anywhere from 10 to $20 a piece. Some of them sell for 60 and 80 a piece. <laughs> I think there's about 40 carats in this envelope. Let's count them up. I have no idea what to do with these. Do I sell them all together? Do I... Look at all you guys. So it's so good to see all you guys. Okay, let's count them up. So we've got one, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 17, 19, 20, 21, 22, I have 22 carats <coughs> in the CZ, and then <coughs> this is rubies. I have three, looks like about two and a half carats of rubies, <coughs> about four carats of onyx and then another carrot oh another another one how big is this one another two carrots of sapphire what do i do with that With all those carrots, right? Yeah, it's about 30, I think. It's right at 30 carrots. Isn't that what we just counted up? Ruby's sapphire. They're all lab created. Well, 
like I said, they sell anywhere from 10 to $20. If I don't include the price of shipping. Hey, Kevin. That's loud. Let me turn that down. Thanks for hosting, Kevin. I can't reach my speaker. There we go. Yeah, so I don't know what to do with that. You can't hear me? I know, I just turned it down. I'm sorry, country. Make yourself a crown. It'd make a hell of a necklace, right? They're gorgeous, too. Like, no joke. They're, they're gorgeous. Like, absolutely freaking stunning. Fifty-eight facets. Fifty-eight facets, internally flawless. Color grade is excellent. Two carat. Eight millimeters. <laughs> Not yet, Islua. You haven't missed much. I was just talking about this find of 30 carats of lab-created stone with all of their certifications and everything because I don't know what to do with that. I did set up this table over here right to my side. So if you guys say anything in chat and I don't respond, I don't answer you, please say it again. Just remind me, whatever because I'm going to be looking over here and I may miss it because my chat's over here. So I'm trying to figure out what to do with this. But here's my plan of attack, okay? We're going to sort bracelets, rings, necklaces. Thank you, Dark. Um, and then I'm going to make sure that there's so many rings, bracelets, necklaces in each bag, you know what I mean? Um, and we'll do the same thing with the uh, cufflinks and all that business. And then we'll find the pin and earring sets because something that we didn't do yesterday that I wish we would have. Let me look in here. I'll tell you what I just found. We had a really cool copper brooch. And I can't remember this, Lou, if it went in your bag or Lucy's. Um... But I found one of the earrings that matches that brooch in this box today. And I was like, oh, those should have went together. So I want to make sure that I take the time today to sort it, which is part of why I, stay, I, I wanted to start early. Okay, I don't know where the hell it is, but there's another cuff link. Anyway, <laughs> because I want people to get like the full pins and, and sets, you know what I mean? No, Beta's not under the desk. He's wandering around. I think he just went in the hallway. Yeah, so we're going to sort this all out first so that we get all that taken care of. So I'm just going to grab a bunch. This is a belt. <laughs> and then I'm just going to start laying all these necklaces over here and then we will figure out what we actually have here in a minute. Oh, look at that bad boy. <laughs> Can you guys see good with it over here? I put the black on it hoping that, wow. 
This is a cool chain. Look. And it's got the little security clasp on it, right? Oh, look, this is a string of buttons that I think one of them just fell to the floor. So that's nice. More pearls. Are they clear buttons? Yeah. You need buttons? Oh. You want little button eyes? You want to make little Coraline guys? Yeah, I don't think these are even the appropriate size, but <laughs> I can find a use for them. Make another octopus. Oh, they'd be perfect suckers for an octopus. Actually, they're a great color and everything. There you go. Dart gets the buttons. This is cool. Oh my goodness. So, what have you guys been up to today? Ooh. Check this out. They asked if Theta's under the desk. He was in here and then hustled on out, so I'm not sure where he's at. These are all wooden. Funky bracelet. Yeah. Card opening. That's fun. Little memory wire pearl and gold. Copper shark's tooth. Oh, we also have belt buckles. Anybody a bowler? <laughs> Anybody need a World Cup 1990 belt buckle? I know that's going to be in high demand. You know those black ones, Mom? These are some cool beads. The what? The black ears. I found the white ones. Little heart. Very <coughs> bold necklace. I love these big chunky beads though. Those have potential. Another giant gold serpentine collar. Obviously, she's a fan of the collar. Another black bead glass necklace. White bead glass necklace. These, here's the thing, okay? Here's what amazes me about all these. Every clasp is like so cool. Like these obviously aren't cheap pieces for the time, you know what I mean? Because every one of them has this like really cool two-piece security, like they're just, they're cool. And then there's this I live in the 80s stuff going on. Hey, gray, you don't see that very often. This is, hang on a second, we'll get to earrings. Can you guys see this? This has gold necklace chain, like braided, woven, with little gold beads. <coughs> can you see that weave? I wonder if you could see it if I put it. Now you can see all the paint in my ring. 
Like I've never seen a necklace like that. This is a nice serpentine too. What is this? Is this for a is this for a pocket watch? Is that what this is? I don't know. Why are you sorting through this stuff? This one's no, it's pressed. Take. Here. This is what's going to take the longest. Nah, that one won't take the longest. Are you sure? So, I don't understand what these guys are. I don't understand what this one is. I don't know if this is for a pocket watch. Keys? Yes. It is fun. It's got a... It's got... This is spring-loaded. Is this gold? I mean, it's obvious that this has been used, right? Some oxidization. <laughs> this piece is plate. Oh, this screws off. Does it screw? No, it's spring loaded too. What is this? Anybody? Y'all know? This is spring loaded too. <laughs> and here's the thing there's obvious wear on this chain. I can see no place where the plate. If it's plated, is chipped or gone, not at any of the links. You can't see any copper or silver fill underneath if it is fill. Well, if this is gold, it's 1.3 ounces of it. So that's worth a pretty penny right there. It's heavy. Oh, look, another ring. That's a nice one. <laughs> I ought to just do this. I'm going to do this. This will work. Oh, it's marked, too. So crazy. So crazy. There's this is such a, a weird mesh of things in here. You know? Like, you never know what you're going to find. Uh, this is marked... Yeah, 
18 karat gold plate. There's a nice little shiny black beads. There's another watch band. We've got three of those so far. Uh, just a piece of chain. This goes with our tie clips and cuff links over here. These nice piece of Jasper. <laughs> Pocket watch holder, right? I don't know where this goes. That goes there, I guess. This goes in here with these really cool beads. I think these are clay. They're obviously handmade. This is an earring. Another gold chain. Another gold chain. We have a broken necklace. Super cheap gold chain with a cross. Random beads. And we're done with that. <laughs> I'm not going to be able to do this. Like, there's just not enough space in the world, guys. These are all necklaces. These are also necklaces. We'll call that sorted. All right, that's, that's sorted. These are all earrings over here. Necklaces. I mean, maybe I should sort what's not a necklace instead of what is. Wow, anybody in Aquarius? We've got the water bearer here. Okay, so earrings, earrings, pin, pin, earrings. Part of a watch. It's a Timex. And some fake diamond stud. Earring. Arrowhead necklace. This is a bracelet. Necklace pin back. Pin. Arm, earring, fake turquoise, another tie clip, pen, <coughs> excuse me, okay, I'm going to set these here, we're going to put these, dark, I need that, have you sorted what's in there, okay, Bracelet. Ooh, nice bracelet. That's a nice bracelet. That's a nice boulder. Gemstone bracelet. What do we have? Snowflake obsidian, rose quartz, ocean jasper, red jasper, aventurine, tiger's eye, amethyst, moonstone, dyed agate, smoky quartz, butterscotch, jasper. That's a nice little gemstone bracelet. Oh, wow. Oh, this is so sweet. It's a butterfly charm bracelet. They 
know, all the butterflies hang down all dangly. Here, look at this one. How cute is this? Can you hear them? That's adorable. There's a little, um, like X's and O's, only they're white pearl hearts. Brace front. Oh, is Louie, you want that butterfly one? And then there's a bracelet that's all sand dollars. Aren't they cute? Can you guys see good enough in this camera if I do that? Or can you see better in the other one? You need the butterfly charm one. Okay, hang on. Where's your bag, Islua? Do you have a full bag? Can you take it over there? No, it's Lewis bags right here. No, you still had four ounces. You want the X and O one, Gabby? Okay. Gabby, don't I need to stick a? Don't you need? Did I need to start you a new bag? Where were we at with you? I think we needed to start you a new bag because I was over by. Yeah, you've got a little bit of room, Miss Lua, but I don't think Gabby does. I think we're over on Gabby. You're like three. Yeah, you are. You have three bags, but I'm pretty sure that I weighed them and they were they were right at a pound or over a pound on each bag. I don't want to short anybody. I don't care how many bags you buy. I want you to get, you know, everything that you're supposed to be getting. Hey, lemons. Okay, this is Gabby's new bag. Well, you can't see it. I'm used to you guys being able to see me here. You can't see me here. Your bag's over there, Gabby. All right, do we have any other bracelets? Okay, this is a bracelet, a really cool pendant, matching clip earrings, another set of matching clip earrings. These clip earrings do not go with this set. Do these clip earrings go with this? They also do not go with that. They might go with something else, though. This is from Avon. It's marked. Um, I don't want this set to get... I'm going to leave it in that. Let's get rid of this bag. I'm going to leave it in that little thing. I don't want it to get separated. Okay. Okay, so this little box has one tiny rhinestone pendant and one tiny rhinestone earring. You see that rhinestone earring? Mm -hmm. If you find another one of those. Here. Do you have it already? No. Oh. I was like, damn. Here. That was quick. Uh, I found these where these are. <laughs> oh, those are cufflinks. And they go over here for now. I also found this stuff for Neil above. That's very nice. She would like that. What's up, Trax? Um, I don't know where his partner is, though. So held up, to, held up here. To this camera, it's easier for you to see because it's bigger for mobile. Got it. We can do that. I just don't know because I'm not used to being all sideways. I don't know which one is best. We also have uh, 
this. Earrings have security backs on the back. They don't screw in. Set like real gemstones, pretty sure it's not, but I don't really know. It's in a box marked Nicholas. Don't know if it belonged in this box or not. So that's a thing. <laughs> it's a, um, no, it's an oval cut diamond. Well, not a diamond. It's probably CZ, okay? I'm not saying it's a real diamond. I don't think it is. Let me hold it. There. So it's an oval cut large diamond with like an infinity symbol across the top and then a smaller diamond at the top and then the earrings both match. So it's like a figure eight with a large stone on the bottom and a small stone on top. I'm going to show you guys this, but I'm keeping it. Just FYI. I'm going to show you what I'm looking at, but I'm going to keep it. That's a set of antique pearls marked EA London on the back. And every one of those stones is actually set. And those are real pearls. We'll be keeping that. We'll just put this underneath our beta cat over there for later. I don't think I want to put that in a $20 mix bag. Uh, 18 inch chain cubic zirconia earrings and necklace. Like something you would find at Christmas at Kohl's, right? That's what this looks like to me. You know the little sets you can buy for ten, fifteen dollars. <laughs> All right. Then we have a bunch of little loose earrings sitting here on the desk. So we're going to throw Dark's way because I think they probably came out of the box that you're in. Mm -hmm. That one's sorted. Sorted. Okay. okay. All right, so I think I have all the bracelets. I think everything I have over here are earrings and pins. All right, let's count these up. <laughs> so, ring number one. Uh, this is the one that's marked uh, 18 karat electro Wait, whatever it says. You see that? Looks like a blue sapphire surrounded by clear stones. Not set like a real stone. Uh, this one looks like a ruby set with diamonds. Not prong set, but they do have holes in the back for light to get through. 
it is marked either D A C or D and C. Nice little cocktail ring. Okay, so I need this to like focus. It's too high over here. Is it focusing? Because I have my glasses on, I can't tell. No, there it is. No. Focus. Um. <coughs> Hang on. Let's do this. Look at that. Much better shot. Now you can see. Exactly, Gabby. I thought I'd just go grab my Pandora box and then you could see what I was talking about. It's still not wanting to hold focus though. Right? So there's ring number two. There's this bad boy. Be perfect for freaking cosplay. Look at that. It's huge, right? It is really a pretty ring. It really is. They are, they're, they're fashion rings, okay? They're not, I don't believe any of this is 14 karat gold. I don't believe any of these are diamonds. I mean, it's possible. Something is, and I just don't know it. You need ring number three. This one, right? Chonky. You need that chonky ring? Okay. Got you, Gabby. It's in your bag. Yeah. Were these three? Uh, this one is marked. I remember this one being marked. Uh, this one is Sarah Coventry. Looks like a tortoise shell. <laughs> Has a really cool texture around that tortoise shell. This is the same ring that every single human being in 1970 had with that tiny, tiny diamond in the center of it. For those of you that were around, I'm sure you remember this. This and the spoon rings were everywhere. Then there's this bad boy. If you're looking to defend yourself in a dark alley, look at the height on that ring. Is that the egg one? Yeah. The thing is wicked. <laughs> It really feels like it should be like with a set or something. I think it really looks like an egg. This lovely shell ring. Right? It's like salmon, peach. <laughs> this ring has wear. The plate is wearing off of it.
This is our panda from the World Wildlife Federation. With stu you want it? No, but you can have that. There you go. This is a tiny tarnished silver ring with a itty bitty diamond chip in it. A tiny, tiny diamond chip in it. This one has uh, three stones, looks a little bit banged up, like somebody's worn it. This is a two-piece ring set where the, okay, so this with all of these gorgeous stones, you guys see that? <laughs> Lots of wear on this ring. Somebody wore it as a wedding ring. Fits into, so that one's a silver ring. It fits into this gold surround. You see it? But you can see the copper underneath the silver on the sides of that band. The layout of stones is gorgeous, though. Like, it's really pretty. No, I'm not sure they're not real diamonds. I don't know. I don't know what anything is. Could be gold, could be diamonds. I don't know if it's not that leaf ring, right? This is really pretty. Big chonky pearl. Exactly, and I think somebody probably wore it as a wedding ring. I mean, it's, yeah. It's obviously meant to be a wedding ring. This has two magnets inside those little balls that touch your hands. Do you remember the rings that were supposed to help with arthritis? That's what this is. This has um, Pawna Shell or Mother of Pearl and Silver. The leaf one. So you, there's a ton of, this is the one you're talking about, right? This wedding ring, right? There is a ton of wear on it. I'm happy to, I'm happy to let you have it. I'm not trying to talk you out of it but there's a ton of wear on it. I'll tell you right now, the stones on it are gorgeous though. That's Gabby's bag. This needs to go in this Lewis bag. This is a cool one too. I just don't want you to, to think you're getting something you're not. You know what I mean? I'm not trying to like trick somebody. It's gorgeous. The layout of those stones is gorgeous. Did they want to see this hilarious shirt that dad got for you? No. There's a double pearl and gold band. This is a setting the stone is missing. It's actually a nice setting for an emerald cut. This is like got a really cool texture on it and then a flower in the center with an itty bitty diamond chip in it. It's a very feminine, girly looking ring. <coughs> um, 
This is set like real diamonds. They're absolutely not real diamonds, and it's missing two stones. This one is missing one stone. All right, so there's our rings. So how many do we have? Four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one rings. <laughs> How many bags are we going to fill with all this, do you think? 20 at least? Yeah, exactly. So I'm thinking, let's let's just... Did you find any of the mates to these while you were digging around there? Yeah, this cameo or this rhinestone or these, these are all the lilies. I didn't find the cameo and I didn't find the lilies. But did you ever find that one? Did you? Grab it and pop those in my second drawer of my jewelry box, please. Because those are all the mates that I found. Those are all pairs. Okay, you know what? Let's do it this way. What I say, I have 21 rings. I'm just going to write this down as we go. 21 rings. We have this bracelet. <laughs> rings is what is that your bag of goodies for the price you set yeah so I want I, I just want to like for the for the bags of stuff that nobody's claiming that I'm just going to put up on Etsy I thought I'll make sure that there's one ring in each bag there's a bracelet in each bag there's a couple of necklaces and then earrings pins right so that I can say each bag contains at least X. So people have an idea of what they're getting. I mean, they're not going to be able to see everything that's in every bag. It's like, unless they watch this VOD, right? Okay, so we have a super stretchy bracelet. We have this weird ass bracelet. Um, didn't I show you guys these? I showed you all these, right? We have this super cool chain bracelet, bangle, bangle, weird ass power magnet bracelet. This is a vintage, I'm going to lay this in this box so you can actually see it. This is a vintage one that probably goes with a set, but what's interesting, can't see. What's interesting about this one is it has a security chain on it. You don't usually see that with costume. It's absolutely costume. Oh, it's marked too. It's marked Coro. Yeah. Two, three, four, five. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, well, those are watch pens. 12, 13, 14, 15, okay, wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 bracelets, 3 random watch bands and a watch. Seventeen bracelets. Got it. One belt, two belt buckles, some random shit over there. These are going to be mine. If I can find their mates. All right, so we're going to move these over here to this corner. Twenty-one rings. Does anybody want one of these bracelets? Before I set them up to be 
randomly dispersed. Um, oh, I have a bottle of water, but yes, thank you for the water. <laughs> no. I don't want to touch. I just wash my hands before grabbing the sheet. Yes, I don't want to touch anything because this is, you know. Old lady? Is that old lady? Yes, I smell like old lady jewelry. This stuff, by the way, is very good. Dear. 100 year old lady. Stop. These are already done. Okay. Okay, so now here comes the, the part. Thank you, Miss Louie. You're doing so great. So let's find I have to I have to this is a tie bar, tie bar, tie bar, cuff link, matching tie bar, cuff links. Cuff links, single cuff link. I'm going to dig through here. And we'll see if we can't find all of these. Look at that. There's a cuff link. These have a really cool stone in them. Right? Look at these cufflinks. Like, I actually like those. You just see a dude wearing a burgundy tie and those cufflinks on a bright white shirt. Nice. You don't wear cufflinks. <laughs> huh? I said you don't wear cufflinks. I don't want to be disrespectful to anybody. I think this is the Ten Commandments written in Hebrew. Maybe. <laughs> hey, Hunt. I don't know the language. Anybody know Hebrew? <laughs> I also don't know if it's really the Ten Commandments. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what, I mean, it could he be, wear those cuff in his suit. <laughs> could be posh tune. That's a pen. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, this is interesting. <coughs> tie clip, tie clip, tie clip. Where am I putting the tie clips? Tie clip, tie clip, <laughs> tie clip, tie clip, tie clip. Cuff link, cuff link, cuff link, random, not finished set. Oh, look, scarf clips, son of a bitch, another category. That's Is that what is? just fucking great. Yes. Why? Are any of those tie clips like the normal tie clips? Oh, look, pins, another category. It's a hairpin, right? There's another cuff link. Another tie clip. There's a different rando cuff link. Jesus Farth. <laughs> That's what it says, yes. That is most likely not real. I don't know. That's what Gabby was going on. Oh. Huh? My dad's gonna be so funny. 20 pounds, random jewelry, most likely not real. It feels pretty real to me, Jam Gabby. <laughs> it's imaginary. Gabby. Ew. Sure, stop it. Gabby, Jesus believes in my jewelry. Look. It's vintage costume jewelry hunt. There's some pieces that I question I mean, might be legit. There's that set I found worth seventy five dollars. There's yes, there's vintage pieces that are worth 
some real money, and uh, I'm selling it by the pound, so y'all can go. <laughs> y'all can go resell it or or. Hey, stop it! Oh, these are matching. This cat's trying to some of this stuff's a little, little random, but probably valuable. If you like to ch collect chicken bones in your in your travels. Here's a nice set of double wishbone pins with a rhinestone and a pearl in them. So, you know, if Jesus isn't your thing and you're into voodoo, voodoo. <laughs> those are the Jesus and voodoo. Hey, cool. Those are the pins for no. you. Hey, hey, guys, I found Bob, Bob, are you out there, right, Glyphnoid, <laughs> she finds Bob, but not the D, Bob, the jewelry builder, Bob the Jewelry Builder. School. Come here. Cool. Buddy, I am in a weird place. Cufflink, cufflink. Cufflink. None of these match. Tie tack with a K on it. This is a wicked tassel. I just poked myself with a pen. I probably need a tetanus shot. Is this a tie clip? Yes, these are tie clips. Skull, yeah, quit! Don't bother the cat. This one says A. Yeah, I got an A, I got a GH, I got a Bob, I got a K. Oh, this is pretty. This one um, I don't know what these are, guys. It's not going to focus. You get out of here. Canco? What's Canco? Mm -hmm. Well, these have security screw backs. Why is this one two They're two marked two? 10 karat gold. Why is this one two, two sides? I'm pretty sure there's some form of cufflink. What are you asking me? I don't know why. I don't know how that works. <laughs> okay. For people who wear two ties. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> oh, look. It's a, little it's a little Cinderella coach. And the wheels move. It has a little emerald in it. <laughs> That's adorable. It's a charm. <coughs> Hunt, do I need to make you a bag? Hunt says buy Bob. Oh, hey, a money clip. A money clip. A new fucking category. Pretty sure these are all actually gold. There's probably actually gold. No, those right there, these in this box right here, yep. those are marked 10 karat gold. Okay, so are there any tie clips, cuff links, anything like that in that other box that you were going through, Dark? No, going on. Huh? What are they? Rings? Earrings. Oh, I was like, son of a bitch, more rings? Another A tie bar. That's weird. I'll show you guys these up close here in a minute. I might have earrings that match some of those bigger pins, though. Oh, look, another ring. We now have 22 rings. This looks like a something from a. What are the rings? Yeah. And 
it is probably a six, six and a half. This is nice. These little guys have screw backs. That has a matching screw back. They're all marked 10 karat gold. And then there's that little, look at that little pendant right there. Don't own money, so don't own a clip, right? A money clip is for men. make a men's category? What should I make a men's thing? But not everything. Hey! Another tie clip. Hey! A matching tie clip. What do you mean cufflink? Cufflink. Fuck. That one doesn't have a... Hey! It's another one that matches. I'm on a roll, guys. That one matches that one. We're doing good, guys. We're matching shit. It's another bracelet. Can you add, can you, can you put 22 rings and 18 bracelets? Hey, that one matches too. Sweet, look at this. Look at me finding shit. It's another... One of these. Need the You're fine. Get You're fine. Okay. Okay, so I think I have... Have I gone through every one of these little compartments, guys? Have I missed anything? I think I have all of the cufflinks and tie clips out of this box. Oh my gosh, there's so many pins and pendants and Yeah, I have matching yeah, a lot of those pins. Okay, good. We'll we'll get that together here in a minute. That's why I sorted the end. Yeah. Okay. But wait, there's more. I know there's lots of them. Want me just to go through? I think these are all just earrings, right? Looks like a mitten. No, that's a pen, that's a pen. Well, if there's a pin in here, it probably has matching earrings. I put these in here. I didn't organize this crap. I don't have any faith in myself in this. Okay. Do you want me to go through it? No, I might have put all of the tie clips in one place. I'm pretty sure you did that. Those are nice. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> I've been finding, like, there's so many pieces like this. Yeah, it's from the 80s. Oh, I'm just joking. This is really pretty, and it's got... I might have a matching set to it. A weird... That's unique. These have to be a reproduction. These can't be real. Right? I know, but I'm not doing this yet. Okay. But wait, there's more. There's always fucking more. Okay. Cufflinks. These are cuff. I only found one of these. Find the other one of these. It's probably in there or Look in here, maybe. I mean, it was, I didn't see it in here. It might be in here. This is where I found this one. Here. This little guy can well, go over there. I have a bunch there. of don't have partners in this box. That's all this box is. Is it, what's it look like? Is that center circle? It's this. It's white with a little blue cross. It's 10 karat gold. And it's, what is that? Is that the same kind of thing? No, it's an earring. This isn't an earring. Mm -hmm. Look at the back. It's like a pin. It's a cuff link. Oh. Where you just stabbed your shirts with them. Mm. Okay. Is this in here crooked? Okay, so first up, you guys are going to have a hard time seeing these. Blackstone, onyx, whatever. Cufflinks.
they have spring loaded action. Okay. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Do you have a weight machine? I don't know if you have a weight machine. 10K gold Bruno Mars spoof, right? All right, there's those. Oh, you said to weigh the gold. Yes, we do have a scale. Oh yeah, I have scales. Yeah, we're weighing each one of these bags. We're putting it. It's a it's a pound of jewelry for twenty dollars. These little gold couplings with a diamond in them. Another set of gold cufflinks. These are kind of shiny and pretty. Another set of... Do they make like men's cufflinks and women's cufflinks or are they all the same? They're all the same in cuffs to cuff. It's like saying they're button up to button up. To button. They probably go in reverse on women's shirts than men's, but I don't know. There's these weird half bead green plastic things. These are also cufflinks. I showed you guys the really nice stone ones. There's a pair of uh, gold triangle ones. A pair of much larger gold with a stone in the center of them. Obviously, this was a theme for whoever these dudes were. Ninja Turtle Cufflinks, right? These guys, I love. There's a bunch of these, by the way, that are labeled swank. These are treasure chest cufflinks. They look like little three-dimensional treasure chests for the pirate on the go. The triangle ones are classy, they are. <laughs> uh, this is a money clip from Amway. You know why it's still around? Because ain't nobody got any money from Amway, okay? Don't fall for that shit. You just leave the pyramid schemes alone, y'all. Tie clip. Tie clip. Tie clip. Uh, somewhat. Hey, Bent. The chest, I know. I like the little treasure chest ones. These are all tie bars. This is a tie bar with an A on it. This is a tie bar with a chain and a GH on it. This is Bob's tie bar. You can have a Bob necklace and a Bob tie bar. Just be Bob. Right. Oh, hey. There's a K tie tack. This is very classy, this tie tack. Let me, I'm going to show, I'm going to show you guys those next. Okay, so here we have a tie bar with a GF. Get fucked on your tie bar. A tie bar with Bob and a tie bar with an A. Aunt says I want to grow up in Bob one day. <laughs> Any takers on the get fucked tie bar? No? Are your initials GF? No, that stands for get fucked. <laughs> A little gold pin knife in there. There were three knives in this uh, batch, and uh, I took them all. I kept them all. Here's another A. 
then let him out. These are the kind of tie clips that clip this way. No tender tie bar. <laughs> I'm trying to get them to all stand up in here so you can see them, but they're, this one's wanting to be difficult. No. Now you're just going to see this in there. Oh my gosh. So there's an A. Little diamond guy. Hey, does this match? This matches these cufflinks. This is a set. Which one? <laughs> does this match something? This doesn't match. This is a set. Oh, that matches these. This is a set. Hey, look at us putting shit together. Set A probably goes with the pirate chest. This is a set. For hard. This looks like it goes with something. Not on this table, but it looks like it goes with something. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Cutting quill pens carried around for maybe 30 years. Rivet that held in the ring finally gave up the ghost. Do you want to see the little knives that I got out of this set that I kept? Yeah, they do. They match. I'm going to be Bob. <laughs> You're killing me. This is um, freaking cool right here. This guy is freaking cool. This is the coolest one. Oh, I don't have mix it up. I'm getting a Gabby. I'm sorry. Okay, so which tie clip should go to Miss Maybe? That's by far the coolest one. <laughs> Can you get in my jewelry box and bring me those three little knives that I popped in there? Yeah, it's a watch band. They're in one of the drawers of that large jewelry cabinet. I think I think I'm going to hold these two. Gabby, tell me what you think. For Miss Maybe? The tall jewelry box with the drawers. There's three or four little knives in there that I took out of this set. Now there's no Cartier in here. They're marked Swank. Both of these in my hand are marked Swank. Most of these are marked Swank. They're all costume. I'm pretty sure they're all costume. Um, this one is marked... Chrysler. Not like the car though. K R E I S L E R. Chrysler. Swank. Um this one is marked with a patent number. This one's swank. 
that A is <laughs> Hickok, U USA. Does any of this mean anything to anybody? I'm logged in. Cigar t store type, they may in fact be pen knives. Right? It's fine, you know, yeah. The thing we think is a watch holder. Yes! <laughs> so this is marked RK, right? It's got a rather long chain. And both of these ends are spring-loaded to open and close. Do you have any idea what that is? Is it for, yeah, see, that's what I said. I thought it was maybe for a pocket watch. You can't find them? Yes, they were in the box earlier and I put them in here. I guess I could give this tie clip to maybe, but I was gonna keep it. I'm keeping these things, you guys. Okay. <laughs> okay, you see this little tie clip? Looks like a little pin. It is a pin. It extends and shortens and it's a tie clip for spies who need to sign things. Never know that I have a pin on my tie. I know, I loved it, right? It's so cute. So I'm keeping that. I did not open a card. Thank you for asking. There's this little pocket knife right here. Nope, no fountain pens. That's the closest thing to a fountain pen that was in here. I did not open a card today. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Let's give me just a second to get through this. These make me nervous because they haven't been oiled. I can't even get that blade out. There's a second and third blade in this one. <laughs> I don't think they're in the Yeah, that's what I, I answered that, I think. And then the world's tiniest, tiniest, tiniest little knife. Look how little it is. And it's made so you can wear it on a necklace. And 
Mm -hmm. It's so tiny, right? <laughs> yep. So those I'm keeping for me. Along with um, all of the military medals, the uh, arrowheads, spearheads, all of that stuff. Those, there are two key rings that I kept. One of them is actually a hidden lighter, which I love. Uh, and the other one is a hidden stamp case. Ant prison, right? Um, oh, what a great quote. Creativity is intelligence having fun. Albert Einstein. Pen goes on a key ring, not a necklace. Love it. All right. So, this is a set, this is a set, this is a set. You guys think we should just make a bag of all tie clips, cuff links? Should I just put these all in one bag? That itty bitty one is a pin knife, yeah. All right, let's do that. Huh? It's Big Cat. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna set this one. I think. Gabby, look at this one. I'm going to set this one aside for um, Miss Maybe. I think that would look nice for her. What's up, Bita Bita? What's he doing? You want a treat? And then as we find other cufflinks and all of that. Do any of the actual sets look like the highlights? Do you any of the highlights? You like it from us, maybe. Um, <laughs> these three have uh, safety screw backs and they're marked 10 karat gold. I am sure that there's another one of these crosses in here. I did not check it to make sure it was 10 karat gold. This one is not marked. The cross one's not marked. The two Canco are both marked 10 karat. And I'm going to put those in the bag. So somebody can make money off this bag if they want to. Look at these bad boys, though. Cuff links and a tie tack. These are some fancy pants stuff. <laughs> I like the pirate chest the best out of all of them. We're gonna throw this uh, arrowhead leather necklace in there too. What'd you say?
Where? What are you doing up here with the beta trees? I'm trying to get them to go look Beta cat. Beta cat, hey, you want a treat? Get up here, right here. Right here so you don't jump on stuff. There you go. <laughs> you can't see him over here. There's no camera. Oh, he is. <laughs> Buddy, I set your treats down. Eat your treats. Like, you can see him. <laughs> your face camera. <laughs> oh. All right. So that bag needs, oh, this can go in there. This pocket watch guy. Both of these can go in there. Did I break it? Well, it's now uh, one pound, two ounces. It's perfect. It's perfect. <clears throat> and what should we call this? Where's my pen? Bitter, are you sitting on my pen? Here's my pen. Um, cufflinks, tie bars, tacks. He likes chicken. But you're going to make a gross mess on my thing so go eat them over there gentlemen's accruture moss I mean I guess we could name this uh, dress up your boy <laughs> how about that Yep, exactly how I wrote it, Hunt. Hunt knows me. <laughs> All right. Okay, we're doing good. I don't feel like I've made any progress at all. Okay, now we're going to sort everything that's not a brooch or earrings, all right? Brooch, look at me failing already. Brooch, 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 pendant, earring, earring, brooch, earring, brooch. Pendant. That's a nice, nice tassel. Brooch. I read it. Brooch. Earring. Pendant. Brooch. Just piles. Uh, strawberry. That's nice. Earring, earring, earring. Pendant. We need to get that out of here. Brooch. Brooch, pendant, pendant, gold chain, brooch, oh look it's an apple, brooch, brooch, locket, carubia, Thanks for following. 
Welcome, welcome. We're not doing our normal today. I don't normally stream on this day, this is true. We are sorting jewelry, putting it into bags. Because we're selling it by the pound. That's what we're doing today. Oh, hi. Welcome, welcome. Right now, I'm going through here and just um, I want to be able to put this stuff into sets, right? So I'm separating out pendants. Oh, look, it's Mickey. Pendants, stuff like that. So that. Uh, we can get to the earring and this. Uh, Gabby said, does that thing you just put down match those earrings from yesterday? The fanned out looking thing. This one? This is all rhinestone. Are you talking about this one? You can't see it. I do not recall that, but maybe. I mean, we did quite a bit yesterday. Pendant. Pin. Pin. Another apple. We'll look at all these closer in just a sec, guys. Earring, earring. I'll put all of these pieces up to the camera so that you can see them. Earring, earring. Earring, earring. Earring pendant. We just have like so much to go through. And I don't want to, because like yesterday, I just randomly threw stuff into bags, and I don't think that people got like the earrings that went with the pins together. Here's the tie tack that goes with those 10 karat gold Canico cufflinks. It's going to go in the dress up your boy bag which is now appreciably overweight but whatever oh, do you want to take one of the belt buckles over? no i don't I, I don't care if it's a little bit higher weight i don't want them underweight Like, I don't mind giving people a little bit more. I just don't want, I don't want anybody to get less. Like that's more my concern, you know what I mean? Yeah, just the earrings that match this. Huh? The earrings that match this. Okay, give me a second and we'll do that part. Huh. <laughs> I mean, I suppose we could have some pendants, pins, necklace. We could have the whole thing, right? Yeah, where it's this, this, and this. Okay, this is nice. This little pin right here. I have the other one. Look at this. That's a nice piece right there. Did you think that was a ninja star? Oh shit, shit, shit. Oh, 
Hold, please. I spent an hour doing this before stream, so I wouldn't have to do it now. My fucking camera arm fell because I've moved it today. Look how low this is. Son of a bitch. Hang on, guys. Why isn't this biting down? So Hunt said that she put down a small in his heart, and then he said, uh, we'll be back after these messages. Right. Oh, you're showing right now that you're trying. Okay, I can't help it. This is difficult to do with one hand. And it's not... What are you doing? Holding this so you can mess with that. Okay, then you, you need to move about six inches down. Thank you. That's where you were holding it. No, I don't understand why this isn't biting down like it's supposed to. Put it back to... Like that. There you go. God damn it. Y'all, I'm sorry. Okay. Not so tight that I can't close it. Like I don't understand what's happening. <coughs> Let go. fucking see. I'm about to lose my goddamn mind right now. Why the fuck is this not holding? It's this part. <laughs> it's not that part. It's this part. No, it isn't. It's that bar right there. Watch. This whole thing is twisting. Okay. Yeah. Hold this up again, please. This stops here. You can watch it all day long. It's not going to move past that. I've never even done this with my fucking camera on, let alone on stream. 
this is a train wreck. Please just lock. It's going to pull all the way off that. <coughs> Here, hold this. Let me get back there. Stream, I'm sorry. No, I broke the shit out of my fingernail. <coughs> okay, where are we? Way over here. <coughs> Move that bag of garbage, please. Thanks. Breathe in and out, repeat. Take I know, breath. right? I got it. Mm. Ah. <laughs> she said, I remember the last two <laughs> There's always something. I just can't afford for that camera to come crashing down on my freaking floor. Because I moved it over here to do this. That would not be okay. I know, right? All right. This is now as close as I can get to that camera because it's way fucking higher than what it was before. So that's as close of a close up as you guys are going to get. But that works. All right. Now you can't hit it. Now I can't hit the camera. This is true. Look, more K's. Gold unicorn. So you got here up. Pendant, pendant, what do you mean I've got here up? That's what your camera sees. Huh? It's what your camera sees is here up. Then zoom back out, please. Just a tiny bit without touching that arm. Now wait. Now wait. Right there. That's good. See, this had that set auto focus faster. Probably. This had a pin, I swear, that went with it yesterday. That we put in somebody's box. Okay, so we're going to get to these in a second. Where do we have, what's in, what's in the box that you sorted? Earrings. Are they just earrings? Yeah, I have two pins. Do you have a blank? Let me have the pins. Oh, they go with the earrings. Set. 
is the only pair that doesn't have that earring set. Okay, that's okay. what I'm not what I'm asking you. Okay, so there's those two really ugly bracelets. I need bracelets. There's several bracelets. I had the bracelets counted. One, two, three, four more bracelets. Twenty six. Are these sorted into pairs? Are these not sorted into pairs? This is the one that doesn't have pairs. There's only a couple in there that are sets. Those are all sets. Okay then. Okay then, these right here are earrings. Maybe sets, may not be sets. You can match them with these that are in here real quick. And then we will find their brooch companions. Okay. Those are all of the mismatched earrings. And then you have other brooches in there? These are all just earring sets. That's the only one that's a brooch and earring set. Okay, but if you have any pins, it's because they match something already, right? Yeah, that's the only one. Okay, so you don't have any mismatched brooches over there. No. All right, I'm going to pop all of these brooches in here. For now, we're going to go through this other box, pull out all of the necklace pendants. The goal here is that I want to put, like, two or three of these rings. Uh, a couple of bracelets, um, match any of these pen pendant sets to earrings, right? So if there's a necklace and earrings, I want it to go together. If there's a pin and earrings, I want it to go together. Seventeen to start, to be fair, then one more was added. What, the For the bracelets? There's 26. So we have 18. No, we have 24. You had 22, you just added four more. I had 18 written down here. Okay. I the top one. So you guys, oops, that goes, that goes here. 22 rings. I have 22. I have 22 rings and 22 bracelets, which is nice. Uh, these are the bracelets that we're now adding. There's two of those. Yeah, exactly, yes, Lewis, 22, which are pretty. There's this big chonky guy with the rhinestones. And then there's this guy. This guy is marked uh, Sarah Coventry. It's a matte finish with rhinestones in it. Well, it's not just a it's very mod, very modern looking. I never know where to start, like there's so much, right? Those are fucking earrings. I thought this was a pin. Dude, that's a set of earrings. Uh, can we see the pearl bracelet that you just added? Sure. Marked Florenza, copyright.
Is that in focus? I can't tell. I think it's in focus. I highly doubt that you can see the the mark on the back on stream, but maybe you can, so let me flop that over. And see the mark on the back of the clasp. Yeah, it's really pretty, right? And as we go to put this stuff in bags, guys, I'll show you. I'll show you too, right? It is really pretty. And if there's ever anything that you want to see, tell me. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Or you want it, yeah, or you want to put in your own bag. Then let me know and we'll start a bag for you and you can pick out what you want to put in it. I do believe that this entire thing, nope, there's a big ass pin. Wow, wow. I was just about to say, ooh, these are cool. Okay, wait. See, this is the problem with treasures like this, is that you try to go through it, set it right here. You try to go through it and you get like all excited because you find something, right? Yeah, it goes right there. Okay, so these are all earrings. And you get distracted, and then you forget what you're doing, and then you just end up looking at crap instead of actually making, wow, yeah. making any progress. Are those all different? No, I don't think they are. I thought that, they, no, see, here's another gigantic bow. Design, if I can make it work with Eliza Tudor. Okay. I don't think I know what Eliza Tudor is. Oh, wow. <gasps> Ooh. These are nice. Oops. Earring, 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 earring. Earring, earring, earring. Yeah, that's weird. Oh, yeah, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's part of a necklace. It's a pendant. Earring, earring, earring. Hey, you remember this guy? What? Don't you don't have that guy? No. Earrings. That's a random ass button. Earrings, earrings. No, thought it was a scarf clip. Just a bunch of earrings. Ooh. It's so fancy in here. Wow, these are earrings. Those are earrings. These are earrings. Oh, Elizabethan Tudor costume, I got you. Dude, look at the size of these things, what? Okay. Who can, we oh. We got another cuff link for dress up your boy. That's exactly why I started early and never get through all this shit. 
Like this is so overwhelming. It's really, really cool. And then all of a sudden I'm just like, oh my God, I'm never gonna get through all this. And then I feel better about it. And then I, and then I don't. <laughs> okay. No, I'm doing it. I'm just pulling out everything that's not an earring. Mm -hmm. Right? It's not an earring. What the f is, oh my God. You guys, it's a whole thing of tiny fuck. Should have stuck with the big one. Oh my God, there's a thousand pair of earrings in that box or in that one compartment. This is definitely a set. Well, there's a pin and a pin. But that's a pin, well, let me put it with a pin. That's a pin set. That's kind of cool. That's like the rooster set. We found that, there's another one. That, uh, but these don't match. That's a pin set. These are cool pin sets. Oh, I wonder if the pin sets are like the little guys that you wore on the sweaters that um, like connected, you know what I mean? Like connected your sweater from here to here. Dogwood. Um. Oh my God, these are so 60s. Oh, these are brilliant. Look at these. Those are great. You guys can't see, I'm so sorry. Uh, these apples went with something, there was an apple. Apple pin, and no, they don't. Yeah. What do you mean they don't? The apple pin has lines. Where's the apple pin? It's like a big metal wire apple pin. Yeah, they go. Oh, I didn't see that other apple. <laughs> okay, I'm going to say that all the rest of this is indeed 100% earrings. So. Are those all earrings? Oh, yes, I'm sorry. I took these out. Big, chunky, chunky. Cufflinks for dress up ya boy. Bag's gonna be two pounds by the time it's done. This is a pin, this is a pin. This is an earring. It's an earring, it's an earring. This weird ass shit here. What's this? Also more weird ass shit. Okay, these go with you. Um, okay, so then we have interchangeable earring sets. Take all the tiny earrings. Oh my gosh, there's a bunch. Okay. Oh, I can make you a whole pound bag out of this tiny stuff. We might be able to. Oh, yeah. Okay, so here we have interchangeable earrings, right? You have these different little guys, and they fit onto these clips. They're not clip on earrings, though. They're, they're regular earrings. So you can change out the color, shape of your earring. Huh? That's a bead. We have another one that has three options. This one's marked Trafari. Looks like a uh, red ivory and tortoise shell. Uh, this set is not marked.
We have this one that does the same thing. Different shape. Also not marked. <laughs> and then we've got this one that is um, clip-ons. Looks like it's plastic, but it looks like rose quartz. And those interchange too is interesting. I got a whole bunch of Christmas over here. Christmas, 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 Christmas. Reindeer in a wreath looks kind of creepy. Christmas, Christmas, mom. Christmas, Christmas. That one says mom. Christmas, 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 Christmas. Okay. Random giganto piece of red glass. Interchangeable ones, yes. All right. This one is marked. This one is not marked. I thought that was a mark, but it's not. This one is not marked. This one is not marked. Christmas tree with a dove and rhinestones. Hey, where's that pin with the little dangly? It's like chain. There's quite a few of them. Looks like that. No, I don't recall one that looks like that. No, there's no chain in here that looks like that. There's a. Um, this tassel, is that what you're thinking of? It's not the same chain either. <laughs> so there's that guy. There's this one, which I actually think is pretty. It's a candle and like ivy in matte and shiny. I actually think that's pretty. Uh, this one's not marked. Little Christmas wreath. No rhinestones or anything in it, just a little Christmas wreath. Not marked Christmas candle. Not marked three rhinestones in it, Christmas stocking. These are Christmas earrings. I don't know what the fuck they are. Maybe poinsettias with ribbons. They're strange. This is a mom pin with a yellow rose. Also not marked. This one looks like a mark that I can't read. I 
can't read this mark. Starts with like a copyright, it looks like, and then something else. So this is a wreath around Rudolph, and Rudolph has blue rhinestone eyes. And the style is either old or bizarre. Your pick. Um, not marked Christmas bells with um, red rhinestones. This is marked Beatrix. Uh, missing two of the red little berry rhinestones. Gold wreath with a bow, not marked. Um, Christmas bells and a wreath. It's got this, it's got the same marking on it that I couldn't read on that other one. Cerna. I'm not sure what it says. And then we have the very, very mod looking Christmas tree with a bunch of super shiny rhinestones in it. It's matte finish. Not marked. So uh, this is the Christmas 50% off bag because it's only going to be $10. I don't think that the interchangeable ones that I had yesterday, I don't think they have anything. These are like all definitely sets, right? And the ones that I had yesterday had the clips, the earring piece, with the other items. And so do all these. So I don't think I'm missing anything there. So I think that that's good. All right. Let's look at this happy train wreck right here. We have a copper arrowhead, the Indian face on it, and we have a whole bunch, a whole bunch of chain with two pendants. One of them is Aquarius the water bearer. Oh, which I think I can actually pull out of here. Nice. I have no idea if this chain, any of it, is anything. I mean, I assume not, but who knows.
some of the pendants that are sitting here. Here's my thought. Let's make a quick bag. Which ones do you want to look at, Isla? In particular, do you know where you do you want me to just hold each one up? Because we can do that too. So you can just see all of them. I do think some of the pendants have matching earrings and brooches. Um, that needs to go over here. So we're going to put the uh, Aquarius back in this. We're going to put this little, this is an incredibly cheap cross, back in there. This gold nugget. Just hard to see on mobile, I know. It's, well, you're not bothering me. Please tell me if you guys want to see something. That's the whole point of me doing this live and not just by myself is that you can actually see there is a whole bunch of these chains marked Korea. Both of these chains, one with a teeny, teeny, tiny diamond chip, one with a redstone and a cube. And these are going in there too. This super funky chain that has the woven chain and balls, the braided one, that's going in there. <coughs> This loose chain, this loose chain. This is kind of funky, I like it. These are all beads. I don't want to put beads in here. Fuck me running. This is this is two more. Two more, three more giant bags of chain. Ooh. Okay, that's not just chain. There's some cool shit in that. This chain can go in here. Okay, I'm just gonna set that to the side for right now. Hey, Lucy Lou. All right, pendants. Here's this gold heart that I just pulled out. Let me stand up. I think right about there is optimal, right? <laughs> Which bag will the belt go in? That Emmons belt? I don't think it can fit in a bag. Uh, it's sitting over here on the table. I haven't put it in anything yet. There's a number one. This looks like it might have like a little jade stone. Not saying it is jade, saying it looks like jade. These are all pendants that we're going through right now. This is actually a locket and it opens. This is a locket and it opens.
if you want to know if something is marked or anything like that, I can definitely look. These are all little um, little solitaires, little one stone necklaces. Well, this one has a thing of diamonds around it. They're not real. So we've got um, a purple stone with diamonds surrounding it, a green one, the jade with your bag. Yes, it's Lua. Um, I'm coming in and out of focus. We've got two clear, a pink. This one is, looks a lot like ruby color. That one there is green. The far one to the top right over there is a yellow color. The one with the clear stones, the diamonds, surround a ruby. That is a gold nugget with a single diamond chip in it. This jade one. goes over here with this Lua. you have another empty box? They're in the tote. I know we have a lot of earrings. <coughs> no, I don't. Wait. But you can do this which would probably make things easier for you. Do you have little baggies? No, I don't want to put them in baggies. These have the rubber bottoms. Uh -huh. <sighs> These are all kind of the same, so I put them all together. But you can like, okay, this has got cat hair and fucking cat hair and everything. So does that one. Okay, whatever. But you can lay them and they'll stay because it's rubber. There's like four of those if you want to sort them that way. And then it'll be easier for me to figure out what pendants go with them. Like that'll work out really nice. Bottom right corner looks like a paddle. You want me to just put the ones that might have pendants with them in here then? Because some of these are just like earrings that don't have anything. I don't know how you would know. Uh, it's uh, like a gold nugget style. So it looks like a squished gold nugget with a little diamond chip in it. You want to see the cross? Has a red cabochon in it. It's rounded. This is absolutely from the 80s. I owned one when I went through my Madonna phase. In like 84. Um, locket. Locket. I think these are the last two lockets. So there's a little Minnie Mouse locket and then a locket that has a pearl in it. And then these two little pieces that would be great for a pair of earrings. Yeah, I do like that cross. There's actually two of them. One of them was put in somebody else's bag already. Uh, this has an engraving on the back of it. It says DEER in all caps for this first piece that I just put in here. That's in the, that's a pen. 
That's in the... Uh, did you mean this cross? Did I put the wrong cross in there? In the top left-hand corner, it's engraved with the word deer. What's up, Crazies Raiden? Hi! Hi, Rai Rai! Tinder Raid. Don't swipe it all, it's a trick. You guys see that color? I'm trying to move it so that the light will hit it so you can see that color because this is so far up here now. This one is a brown tone stone. What's up, crazy? How did you do? This one has a green, looks like emerald, alexandrite, ruby, and diamond. They're obviously fake. Uh, this one looks like ruby with pearls. And then the cross is all gold. This looks like the most inappropriate earring I've ever seen. Okay. <laughs> We're looking at pendants right now. We're going to match up all of our earrings and pendants and um, brooches here in just a second. And then we're going to start throwing stuff in bags. Red Cab Mart. I'll check it. So right now I'm just showing you guys everything. So you can ask questions about anything before I start putting them in bags. You got a little bit of a headache, Crazy? I'm sorry. <clears throat> and then if anybody wants me to um, set something aside for them or put it in the bag, uh, this red cap with the pearl is Mark Trafari. You're right, it does have that feel, right? Is the one with the brown stone too big? Because I think that looks like Definitely looks like a Renaissance piece. And that pearl scroll work bracelet, got it. Uh, this little guy, by the way, his little wheels move. It's so cute. Um, this is the bracelet that you're talking about, right, Ben? Just to make sure I've got it right. <coughs> ah, I see what you're saying. Okay. Yeah, this brown one is faceted. Um, oh, here's a pin one. Oh, literal pin. Oh, all right. I did not start my book, thank God. What is this? This looks like it is. 
This is the torch from the Statue of Liberty with a coin that's like blackened on half of it in the top. There's a gold unicorn, a weird ass rose, a round pendant that uh, reminds me of spoon carved wood. The mini one? Sure, Gabby. That's the Statue of Liberty one. And then a little acrylic heart with a bow. Statue of Liberty has a little coin in the top of it, but it's like black on one half. <coughs> Here's the mini one for Gabby. And then we haven't shown this one yet. And then there's this tassel. Unicorn, as Louie needs the unicorn. Got you, I got you, it's okay, hey fish. Hey Zoe, awesome. So how it's working is if you see something that you like, as I'm holding them up, then you tell me that you wanna see something or if you wanna know if something is marked, that's the inside, Gabby. And the carriage with the little moving wheels, okay. So you tell me what you want, just like Gabby just did. And I'm going to have a little bag here, right? So it's $20 for one pound of jewelry. This is interesting. I wonder if there's earrings that match this. Uh, let me see. It's got a brown, round bead in the center. This weighs nothing, you guys. No. It weighs nothing. There you go. It's not marked anywhere either. But it's got such nice detail. Oh, I guess it's a cabochon in the center and not a bead. get very excited and yell. <laughs> 24 hours, no internet, oh my gosh, fish. It's not an option. Um, I don't know. Hey, do the phone thing. Can you do the phone thing? When can you when can you do the phone thing? I need you to do the phone thing. I want to know if this necklace was made during World War II when they were rationing metals. All right. Well, I might not be able to get anything. Well, that's what I need to know. 
So I need you to go work that out for me. I can find a lot of things on Google. I can't find everything. <laughs> If there's not another one. I need to know that exact thing, okay? If it's the only one, I can't give you any answers. There has to be one on Google already. <laughs> well, Zoe's hosting things, Zoe. All right. I don't want to even look at these. I don't even want to do this. I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. But I'll want to the second I open it up because, you know. Do you want to start looking through the ears? No, I'm going to get to the earrings last and match them to all of these pieces. That's going to be easy. <laughs> no, it's not. It's not easy. I know. Uh, there's a lot, okay? We have a lot. Gabby, this, look like this, this, this so looks hard. like that necklace. Only it's you need that necklace, Lucy. I don't know what it is. Only this is wire work. So I have, I know that there's several pieces that have the same style to hold the round in, right? But most of them look like this where they've got that open wire work. This is the first one I've seen with that really nice detail. Uh, I do have a couple of stick pins over here. I have a flower and I have a letter C. Uh, those are the only two I have sitting over here, but I, I thought we had more. Lucy wants the flower one. Hang on a second. Ben asked, in fairness, Ben asked to see them. I got some bumblebees. <laughs> Not the stick pin. Toss the C in your bag. I'm sorry, Lucy. Are you are you talking about this necklace right here? This one, right? that I'm asking Dark to look up for me? Are you talking about that one? Or the little the little flower one that I just showed that's the wire work? Y'all. <laughs> Not the stick pin. Yes, the stick pin. I put the C monogram stick pin in your bag, Bent. Do you also want the floral stick pin? in your bag. No. Excellent. Lucy Lou, you want the floral stick pin. Stream delay is gonna, gonna mess me up, y'all. Blink twice. <laughs> <coughs> it's okay. Throw your phone out the <laughs> You're okay. It's okay. I know there's stream delay. It's going to mess people up. <laughs> no, you do not want the floral stick pin. You want the floral necklace. Yes? This one right here. And you don't, you don't need to apologize. I'm just trying to get it right. It's okay. We can take our time. Correct. Excellent. I'm putting this in your bag. Uh, I'm putting this in your little um, second bag that we started with the rings. 
I'm going to pop it in there, okay? It's okay. We have all night. I started early so that we could get through all of this. So we're okay, right? <laughs> we're okay. We'll get through it all. I'll make sure that we stop and take time and that I know that what you're telling me what you want is what I'm actually putting in your bag because I don't want to mess that up for anybody. So it's okay to ask. I'm, the whole reason we're doing this live is so that you can do that. So I'm 100% happy to take my time and do that so you guys don't have to apologize or worry about asking or anything else. I want you to. Speak up. Yes, and that's why dark is helping. Okay, so there's our pendants. This goes over here. Okay, so I'm going to move. I think the bags are breeding. We've got it's got we've got it everywhere, okay? I have stuff on this you desk. Can, I like, set up I set up this table so that I would have another four foot of room and then all over here I can't stand up. is more. Like we're not in a hurry. We're going to take our time today. We've got too much. It's overwhelming. All right. So here's what I'm going to do. Y'all saw the dress up your boy bag, right? Everybody knows what's in the dress up your boy bag. That is uh, cufflinks, tie pins. Huh? Oh, was he serious? I didn't know if he was serious. He did say that though. I don't know if he's still. I don't think he's serious. Hunt, did you want to buy this bag? Did you want me to put your name on it instead of putting it on Etsy? The dress up your boy bag. I didn't know how said that though. I didn't know if you asked him if he was serious or not, but I know he said it. Okay, so then we have this 80s attorney lady bag. Does anybody need to see that? Because I'm going to set these aside. I'm going to post on Etsy real quick these bags that we have done. And then we're going to start matching up sets and bagging up new bags. So there's the 80s attorney lady. There's some interesting attorney pieces in there. If you're interested in being. That person that wears power jewelry from the 80s, that's the bag for you. Uh, this is silver and beads. Um, in this bag, there's some black acrylic and glass hand-painted beads that have really, really cool gold pieces between them. Uh, some carved acrylic pink beads with Asian looking symbols on them and then a bunch of different silver pieces. I'm a hundred percent. No, it's all right. We're going to leave it. We're going to leave it. There's a pair of cufflinks in here that are called come apart. <laughs> but we're going to leave it. Set this one aside for you, Bent. I believe this is already listed on Etsy. Let me look. You may give it up, but maybe. Okay. Okay, so Bent, if you want this one, it's called uh, Silver and Bead. That's the listing, okay? Can you see it? Silver and Bead. That's what it's called. So if you want it on Etsy, it's already listed and it's there. Just so that you get the right bag. <laughs> 
This is um, silver bag one. This is already listed on let's on Etsy. It is all silver stuff. Um, lots of big earring pendants. Uh, like a there's a chrysanthemum looking dude in there. That's a pin. Lots of big hanging pendants. Really really nice size. Uh, quite a few brooches, some fake turquoise, a bunch of different stuff in there. And that's listed under silver bag one. So these are going to go over here out of my way because I need to clear some space. Um. <coughs> I think we're going to first, before we even start matching everything up, I think we're going to make a uh, bead and pearl bag. So let's start with these. Why did I lose my glasses? Had to adjust your audio. Okay, crazy. Welcome back. Um, this is a nice uh, art glass amber beads with brown striping. Oh, it's marked Napier. This is a Napier necklace. Um. <coughs> Uh, gold tone beads, lots of wear on them. Acrylic beads. That texture. Tired of getting blasted with your audio and your headphones, but the stream was fine. Oh, I'm sorry. This is a two strand, much the same texture as the other one, but all the beads are the same size. Nice, nice gold spacers between these beads. They have almost a copper cast to them and they look like rope. Very nice detail on those. <laughs> all these are gonna go in this bag because we're gonna make a big bead bag. Um, Gray oval beads. These are not Swarovski crystal, I'm fairly certain. But they do have nice shine. You're gonna have a hard time seeing them. They're bicones. With clear seed beads set between them. What necklace? One of those Lucy said she wanted it. I put it in her bag, so we moved on. Nah, it's all right. A bunch of different shape. Um, this is not just cream. It's got like a gray dots, like it's supposed to look like stone, only it's obviously plastic. I don't believe it's marked. <laughs> this is so nice for what it is. White glass beads. Oh, see that's crazy. This is a shirt that my dad bought for my mom. Yeah. That's an extra large shirt. Look how tiny it is. On an extra small person. <laughs> okay, I was pissed. These are glass, by the way. <laughs> with a gold security clasp that has a matching white glass bead in the clasp. I'm average height, Mom. I'm just, you know, tiny. Try to get here. This has a screw clasp on it. It's kind of nice touch.
black acrylic beads. Black double strand acrylic beads. Um, I can't decide if these are paper or wood. They're super, super lightweight. They might be paper. <coughs> they might be wood. No, I think they're wood. Yeah, I think they're wood, and they're only painted on the outside. Kind of like a tribal. Okay. All right, we're at a pound four ounces, so we're going to call that one full. It's over full, but I don't care. Um, yeah, that's not beads. <clears throat> Catch a man's attention. We're going to call this the bead bag. Okay. <sighs> Look at me making progress, guys. I'm doing a good job. Okay. I just dropped something on the floor. What are you doing? Don't hit me in the butt. Oh. This is fucking cool. Does this have earrings, bracelet, anything that matches it? Oh my. I haven't seen it. It's not marked. Yes, I have a pair of earrings over there. It's not marked. This is a cool piece. Here, I'm going to hold this up closer so you guys can see it. I don't know where they are though, but uh, I do have something that looks like that. Maybe. I don't know. I've gone through about 150. 70s, you think so? It's not marked. I don't know what it is. It surprised me that it's not marked. School out. <laughs> Um, sort of a cross. Blue cabochons. On a gold chain. It's not marked either. Oh, wait. It's marked Sarah Coventry. You want that one? The chain is, I should, I should correct myself. The chain is marked Sarah Coventry. There is no way for me to know if that chain originally came with that pendant, you know what I mean? Really? 
this is marked <laughs> no fucking way this is marked with my name y'all that's for me Heavy chain monogram bracelet. Monogram with KM. And uh, it's marked Spidel on the back. <laughs> yeah, that's. That's a keeper. So we have one more bracelet. Um, this is cool. This one is really cool. Check this out. Is it focused? Can you see the flower detail? It's all metal. There's no stones in it. <laughs> yeah, I got 23 bracelets. This is a necklace. But isn't that cool with the silver and gold? It's not marked either. <coughs> this is a big ass chain. That is a big ass chain. Gold rope with uh, silver balls, not marked. So if you guys want anything to go into a bag, okay? Unless I just randomly steal it for myself. <laughs> um, you tell me. It's a, a bag weighs one pound, that's 0.45 kilograms. And it's 20 bucks, no matter what's in it. Do you want that silver gold flower for you, Bent? So these O's are frosted, and then there's two little frosted guys that hang down. This two strand necklace, it's kind of interesting. Gotcha. It's in the bag. It's in the bent bag. Ooh, this one is cool too. This one's marked Monet. A necklace, a series of S's with frosted circles in the center. Gold chain, a pendant, um, black faceted stone on top, teardrop pendant, looks like leopard print on the inside.
Then there's that bad boy right there. Panda! In here flashing your bits. What's up? Now you're on your desktop? Okay, slow. <laughs> I'm trying for you. Take most of these apart and turn them into other things. Yep. That was my intention when this tote got dropped off at my house to do that. I have not got to it. I probably won't. Which is why we're doing it this way. That's a pendant with two roses painted on it. Want to come say hi? Hi, Panda. Thank you for the bits. Appreciate you. How you been? You want the S chain. Got you. Did you see this one bent since you're selecting since you're selecting those particular ones? Did you see this one? Were you in here when I showed this one? Because you may like it too. The rose pendant, Lucy? Okay, I got it. Is that focusing? There we go. You doing all right, Panda? I'm glad to see you. Wasn't before Crobial used that one, so toss it. Okay. <coughs> it just occurred to me that I had showed that one earlier, and it seems to be in the style that you're you're looking at, right? So I didn't want you to miss something. Happy to see you. Yes. This is marked uh, Napier. No, it's not. This is marked Vonda USA. This is not a locket. It does open up. This is a perfume cache, right? So it's all open weave on the front. You put the um, like waxy perfume stuff right there. It looks like kind of chapstick. That's what this is for. Looks like that. And then opened, it looks like this. What the fuck is Shira? You have one of those in your car, right? Better work great in your car. Okay, and then we have this big knobby triangle. I don't know what that's about. Looks kind of like a weird bu belt buckle. It's marked uh, Coventry. It doesn't say Sarah Coventry, it says Coventry. There is a difference. <laughs> this is fucking cool too. Look at this. Okay, well, uh, it's 
so that's attached to a chain. Those two flowers are frosted. Everything else is shiny. <laughs> Look at the necklace that looks like it has a belt buckle on the end, please. Not the triangle. S. Lua wants this one. Okay. Belt buckle, not the triangle. S. Lua. <laughs> This one goes in here for a slua. I think this is the one you're talking about. Maybe this one. <coughs> it's got two O's that are frosted and then it's got these little bottom Guys, these are also frosted. There you go. It does not slide. All the pairs I can find that aren't. <laughs> oh, yeah, it might. Do you have any other boxes in here? No, I don't have any other. Am I putting this in your bag, Eslua? Okay. <laughs> no, I don't think I do. Eslua, you made it. You're at one pound. You're cut off, Eslua. <laughs> no, you're not really. Right. I know we haven't got to the earrings and the pins yet. I'm working. Okay, I'm working on it. Wow. Is this bad boy marked? Is that Bakelite? No. Nah. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's not. Not Bakelite. Looks like Bakelite. Marked Avon. <coughs> it's a tortoiseshell brown, by oh, the way. Here's some more interchangeable colored earrings, by the way. Yeah, Penny, right? Nice. Okay. So here's how we're doing it, guys. I'm showing these pieces so that anybody here that wants to select a piece for themselves and put it in their bag. So one pound bag of jewelry for twenty bu for twenty dollars, right? And pick out what you want in your bag if you want, or you can just pick a bag that I put together if you want. So I have four bags already put together that are going up or are already on Etsy. Um, and then I am making everyone's individual bag. And then here in a minute, everything that's left is going to start going into bags and then we're going to put them all up on Etsy. This is a faceted brown stone. Is it blurry? The coin one was, it's like a, um, it's like a modern, it's got like circles in the background and then like rectangles and squares and like, there you go. See, the problem is, is that <laughs> I need my glasses on to see all these marks, but when I put my glasses on, and look at the monitor, it's blurry, so I can't tell when stuff's blurry on the camera. I have to keep, yeah, not quite steampunky, but yeah. 
It's all right. I can figure it out. I'm just saying that's my struggle. Um, perfume locket. Is that another one? I think it is. It doesn't want to open for me. Please open. Why don't you open? Maybe it's just a locket locket. Oh, it's a locket. Regular locket. Um, maybe a monogram on the front. Super interesting chain though. No, I don't think it's a monogram. I think it's just a design. Marked Park Lane. But take a look at the chain. Isn't that cool? Yeah, I like it. It's Mark Park Lane. But I like the chain. It's interesting. Uh, this is a slider necklace from Avon, meaning this pendant can move up or down on the chain with the tassels. It's a... Uh, green fake jasper with chain tassels on the bottom. You made a watch chain kind of like that? That would be nice. This is a heavy, heavy ball chain. This is a um, woven wire or rope chain. Absolutely no tarnish anywhere. Which can only mean it's not marked. So it's either never worn. <laughs> Gold filled. Gold. Serpentine necklace, very long braided serpentine necklace. You're not going to be able to see this. This is a purple stone been carved out into a reverse cameo. It's a very dark purple stone, so I put that little piece of paper in there. And then we have a copper bow on a tiny tiny copper box chain pearl set in it appear to be discolored no markings
Very interesting, though. Purple cameo? Okay. It's yours. Like the purple cameo. Oh, both of you. Um. <laughs> Okay. Well, how do we do this when somebody wants something? I mean, Lucy asked first. Lucy has an entire bag of cameos over there. I hope you're not fighting. Don't fight, you guys. Right? I mean, I guess it really is like first come, first serve. Because it has been that way all night. And it was that way yesterday, so we should probably stick with that. Pull out. Out. Actually said, I'll take it as you set it aside. The specified cabinet. I have a lot of cameos, so if they want it, that's cool. I don't want to put you guys on this spot or make anybody uncomfortable. And I'm not trying, it doesn't matter how many you have, but that's fine. We've got two rhinestone balls not attached to anything. Okay. Did it pop up that way on yours? See, this is the problem. Yeah, so it says, I made a watch chain kind of like that. I'll take it when you're setting it aside. And then Lucy said, I'd like the purple cameo. Please. Oh, I see. And then Bent said purple cameo. Okay, I'll put it in Bent's bag then. And then Lucy also said that they have a lot of cameos, so that way they can take it. So it would technically be Bent. I got it. I'll put it in Bent's bag then. Since you did say I'll take it first. Uh, this is ruby and um, clear stones. I'm tempted. Like some of these need to be on white so that you can see them. Right? The flower one's pretty but not quite your style. <laughs> this blue, if you like flowers, there's some really, really It's very, very... Earrings. Yes, there are earrings that are freaking amazing coming up. Uh, this is all chain and one cross. It's a plain gold cross. I think he's just eating his bone. So those are just gold chains. The flower one's pretty, but not quite. I read that. A lot of cameos, right, right, right. Bent asked first, which, right, 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 we got it. This cameo <coughs> is in Bent's bag. Okay. Whew, making progress. Nope, still more. Giganto pendants. Okay, so we're going to go through this bag, too. Oh, my gosh. Dude, it's crazy. Look at this. You guys can't see this? I know you can't see it yet. Give me a second. I'm doing it. It's faceted. Um, bright green. Um, rhinestones, white pearls, and then this uh, stripey faceted pendant. And then the chain goes from this to a regular chain. Not marked. Okay. 
Is that Caribia? Am I putting this in Ben's bag? Are you guys together or am I making you your own bag? It does kind of look like a turtle, right? It's so pretty. Like it's, it's really pretty. They haven't said yet. I see. How you been, Cosmic? I haven't seen you for a minute. It's good to see you. <clears throat> I'll put it separate for right now, and then if they need to be combined, you tell me. Toss it in. Okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, I can't toss it in Ben's bag. Ben's bag is full. Ben's bag is full. We're in bent bag two. Or one for each of you, however you want to look at it. This is pretty too. This is another one of those um, like frosted glass floral pendants. Let me see that turtle necklace again. And that one you just put in. There, darling. The what? It's right here. It's right here. Flemish miniature. It does. It's not marked. It's nicely done. That one. More gold chain. Didn't I have a gold chain, just like plain gold chain bag going? I do. I do. Because all of these little gold chains that I'm tossing over here are going to tangle up um, everything. Alexa online asked shipping cost to Canada. I don't think that's that bad, is it? Excuse shipping cost to Canada for one pound. UK's the bad word right now. Um, hang on a second and I'll tell you how we can find out real quick, okay? Uh, click that link. Select 80s attorney, <laughs> 80s attorney lady, which is what a bag of, of jewelry is, right? Because that's one pound plus packing and everything. Uh, and it should tell you what your shipping would be on that. Um, rhinestone heart, whole bunch of rhinestones. Like and then a single... Uh, rhinestone square. It's got a ton of rhinestones. They look like they're prong set. They're not. They're rhinestones. Uh, this square one is marked Monet. Try to send a small package of origami hearts. They wanted you to pay $10 to ship it. Exactly. And I pay that, which is the fun part. Another big locket. 
I can't wait. We're almost, we are almost, we're almost through this, you guys. We're almost through this and we get to start putting all of the earrings and all of that stuff together, all of the brooches, and I'm excited for that. It's a big like teardrop with scallops around it. Bag. The Monet, the Monet rhinestone, the square rhinestone. Shipping is 11.69. Or the locket, the locket, I'm sorry. This is plastic. It's got plastic, clear, faceted beads, uh, gold bamboo shaped beads on a gold metal chain. I want to play with the jewelry too. Everybody wants to play with the jewelry, right? It's fun just to discover stuff. Like every now and then I open up something and I'm like, holy shit, look at this, right? Like there's just something amazing around every... This is cool. Non-original clasp. <laughs> Round box chains with um, oval beads. Untangling chain is therapeutic for you. Nice. This has actually come up a, a part uh, super easy. I haven't I haven't struggled at all tonight, which is shocking. Uh, two black and gold rope chains, uh, different lengths. This is interesting. <laughs> it's like different types of chain and beads. Random chain bags. Throw the random chain bag. I can do it. I mean, it's going to, it's definitely going to get up there. In weight. Very large serpentine chain. Uh, another black and gold smaller size rope chain, regular gold chain. So I just picked a random thing in the code. It's about twenty two dollars. A third length of black and gold rope chain, same weight as the other two, which means these go together. Yes. No. This is heavier. That's heavier. It doesn't go together. The fuck, lady, with all your damn rope chain. I have four different black and gold rope chains. <laughs> four different lengths, three different weights. Uh, tarnished gold beads. More broken pieces. The only broken piece I've found so far, we have two, these two little broken pieces here, and then a leaf off of a pear pen. So when I got this, it came to me in a tote, and I went through it and sorted it and put it all into um, this type of a box to make sure that it was all safe, and then it sat there. 30 to 75. I looked up a specific zip code and it was 2219. Yeah. 
Okay, so this is a um, necklace that has a charm holder. It has a four-leaf clover, a heart, and a butterfly all in gold. I'm trying, there's no good way for me to show this to you. But you can see the charm holder and the charms hanging there. <laughs> yeah, so unfortunately, uh, one pound of jewelry. Is it worth, what is it, 50 to $95 for a pound of vintage jewelry to you? I can tell you right now, I don't know if it is. I can tell you that I know that there's several pieces, these pin and earring sets that we're going to get into right now, like two more minutes. I can tell you that there's some that I priced and they'd sell for 50 and 60 a piece. There's um, at least four pair of earrings that I know would sell for over 50. There's a belt here from Emmons that I know prices at 65 to 85. There was that so, set that uh, Gabby got at 75 by itself. Gabby got a set that was 75 by itself in her bag. Um, so if you're looking to resell, <laughs> here's what I'm going to say. I wouldn't guarantee that you're going to get any of those prices, even if you look them up on the internet. I mean, seriously. You can, if you already have a shop and you think that you can, you can pull it, do it. I'm not trying to get into your finances. That's your business. Um, but I don't, I mean, I can tell you if they're marked or not. I can show you the condition on the camera as best I can. I'm going to pop them all into bags that look like this, I'm going to pack them in bubble wrap and ship them off to you, right? So this is a, I'm not saying I'm not trustworthy. I'm saying I'm not making you any guarantees that you would be able to resell it and get $95 back on a pound of jewelry. You know what I'm saying? That's a lot. However, if you collect vintage jewelry, well, I can tell you that the necklace that I selfishly put aside for myself right here is worth about $600. So there's that. I did take that out of the bags. That's for me. <laughs> right. So I've been picking and choosing things for me out of here that I want to keep. Uh, I'll probably never resell them. Right. And I think it's cool. Like we can do this, um, right? 20 bucks a bag and you guys get a good deal. And if you want to resell it, cool, go resell it. That's awesome. Do whatever you want to do. If you want to buy a bunch of stuff for you for 20 bucks, you're getting a pound of jewelry for 20 bucks. Like that's a steal, right? Um, and it's fun. <laughs> like it's just fun. This is just fun for me. Uh, but I just don't want to, um, I don't want to ever mislead anybody. You know what I mean? Yeah. Or you can, you can deconstruct it and make something else, right? Which is cool too. You'd be keeping everything. So Alexa, this, what you're, what you're seeing here is, is a tenth of what we have. Oh, we're not even close, Miss Maybe. Um, a, a friend of mine's fiance's grandmother passed away, and in her estate, she had jewelry from the 40s to the 2000s, right? So that jewelry was boxed up and put into a tote. And by tote, I mean your full size garage totes, right? Tote. Filled. Over it. Filled to the top with jewelry. Couldn't shut the tote. 
from this one person. So this is her life from the 40s to the 2000s. This is what this woman wore, right? This is how she represented herself. It's pretty cool. Like, it's really cool. <laughs> I haven't found any Bakelite yet, Gator. I've been looking for it. Oh, they got rid of some really nice antique furniture, too. Yeah, you wouldn't believe what they got rid of. I don't even want it. I don't want to get into it. It makes me sad. But anyway, so I have been, I've had this here because, um, for instance, when my husband's grandmother died, I made a memorial piece, right? So I made a memorial necklace out of her pieces of jewelry that I had inherited from her. And it was my intention and the person who dropped it off's intention um, for me to do something like this with all of that, right? Um, but there's, it's too much, it's overwhelming. Not to mention, okay, I paint. I do pyrography. I do make jewelry. I don't so much anymore. On Thursdays, I own and operate a soap cult. So that keeps me busy. Um, <laughs> watch, my soap cult members will just pop right up now because I said something about it. Uh, so, <laughs> um, so I haven't had time to do anything with it and it is taking up a huge chunk of my real estate in this studio. I was talking about it uh, on Thursdays, the end of Thursday's stream and I was like, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna bag this up and uh, we're gonna do it for 20 bucks a pound because I have 36 pounds of it. It's true, don't eat the soap. Don't drink the Kool-Aid, don't eat the soap. It's the first two rules of soap cult, okay? <laughs> um, yeah, so that's what we're doing. Um, okay, so we are now to the point that we can start to match uh, earrings, necklaces, brooches, and do all of that. There are some freaking gorgeous pieces. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Um, bent and, am I saying your name right, Corba, Corbia, Karuba? Tell me how to say your name. Tell me how to say your name. I don't think you guys saw that one either. Do you want it? It's a cabochon as well. You're not wrong, Gator. You want that one too? Okay. I think this is one of the ones that I pulled out before you were here. Uh, when we're going through earrings, it's not. It is stone. I don't know if it is or not. It's not marked. When we're going through earrings, bent, remember this pattern. I think this has a pair of earrings that match it. All right. Koruba. Carubia. Yeah, kind of like Columbia. Carubia. Oh, that's Columbia. very pretty. What bag will the necklace that has the flower pick on it be? In? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Here's the thing. So, you, if you decide that you want a bag of jewelry, as I'm going through everything, you're going to go, hey, I want that, put it in my bag. I have bags here people name them. with people's names on them. Here's one for Gabby. Here's one for Carubia. <laughs> so they're adding to their bag the pieces that they actually want in their bag to make their pound. I'm selling it by weight. It's one pound per one pack of jewelry, one pound of jewelry for twenty bucks. Or ten. So you fill up your bag, right, as you go. I'm going to post on um, Etsy. Well, yeah, keep putting them back here. See that link right there? <laughs> Gator. Um, so that link is going to take you to a horrible picture that I snapped real quick just so that I could get this up, right? But you'll notice that Gabby 
is an, is an option when you go to buy something, that's because that's Gabby's listing and she's gonna pay for that one. Is Lua is an option. Lucy Lou is an option, right? And then all of the other bags are named randomly. So if you choose to fill up a bag right now with everything that you want, I'm gonna put it on Etsy with your name on it. It'll say Alexa Online. And you can click that one and buy your own bag so that you know you're getting the right one. And then if you want any of the other ones, I will show those off for you guys later, like our 80s attorney lady. Uh, silver bitch is already gone. This is silver bag. Make Dolly Parton an option. This is uh, dress up yo boy. And this is silver and beads. Names will vary, okay? Uh, everything in my shop is free shipping over $30 in the U.S. So for one one pound bag at $20, you would pay shipping. If you buy two, I will pay shipping. For a pound and a half. I'm not selling it by a half pound. I mean, I suppose if somebody really wants that, I can do it, but whatever. A personal bag. The black and shiny bag. Does that make sense, Zoe? Um, we've got some acrylic beads in here, uh, some black glass beads, hand painted with roses. Really, really cool spacer beads. Um, these have kind of an oriental pattern on them. And then we've got some silver brooches, uh, silver leaves, silver earrings. Really nice silver earring and brooch set there. One that looks like wheat, it's kind of cool. A set of cufflinks here that are uh, labeled come apart, K-U-M dash A dash part, which made me laugh <coughs> way too hard. <coughs> I'm joking. I'm gonna die. No, you're not. I am. I'm gonna choke to death right here, right now. I'm not gonna make it, Chet. <laughs> she says, like, I'm not sitting here until we don't know uh, what to do. I'm not gonna make it. You're not even actually choking. My eyes are watering for fuck's sake. You're not okay. I'm fine. I'm over it. Drama averted. <laughs> A jade bead bracelet in that pile. No. I have a, uh, I have a bracelet that's got multiple little gemstones on it, no jade. I have a like weird wire, memory wire one with pearls in it, but I don't have any actual beaded bracelets. Oh my gosh. Call dibs on the jewelry <laughs> she croaks. <coughs> <coughs> Take a walk break. Be back. Okay, Gabby. I see the colors, but no details. What are you seeing? I don't know what you'd be seeing that's green over here. Just see pink and green? You must be seeing this. It's just a little tumbled gemstone. Like souvenir bracelet. Maybe that's what you're seeing. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Uh, or you might be seeing this bad boy right here.
You look at me. Because I'm looking at you. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Look at it. I'm freaking angry, okay? I've got my angry eyes out. Alright, I'm sorry. <laughs> it really does. All right, guys, give me like just a couple of minutes. I'm going to take a quick break. And uh, then we're going to get into all these earrings and brooches and all of this. Pounds and pounds and pounds and pounds you and pounds. Pound just oh, we can have more than one pound of earrings. I said you could have a pound of just the earrings. The pendant necklace that has a large dark square stone in it. Is it waiting for a set? This one is amber colored and the stone is faceted. Do you want that one? Like 100% if you want something, just call it out. If we find earrings or anything like that that matches as it goes, we'll pop them in there with it. You don't have to wait. It's probably better if you don't actually. You can, maybe you can see it better if I don't have it against that black. Because it's a lighter stone than, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's faceted. It is pretty, though. All right, I got to go blow my nose. I'm going to go potty. I'm going to take a little break. I'm going to be right back. And we're going to go, go, go.
Okay, I'm coming back. All right, here we go. Which one are we doing first? Let's start start with those because those are easy to look Let's at. just do this one first. Okay. Okay. Order for everybody. I'll just have one person deliver. What are you ordering? I was gonna order my sandwich. Okay. How's that? I just walked back in. I don't care. I really like their potatoes and salmon. Their steak wasn't that good though, so I was gonna just get their salmon. Okay, well I want that half southern fried chicken salad. This is Skull. Him is my Dover's. Yeah, he is, he's Dark's baby. He's a service dog and he definitely is my baby. He is a service dog. So whiny that he can't be in this room right now. <laughs> he's like All four right. steps away at the door staring at me. Come so on. let's take a look at what we've got here. Come on buddy, there's a lot of stuff on the floor and you're a very big clutchy horse. Go, go horse dog. We've got pearls. That don't match this. See if we can match a pendant to some of these earrings. Okay, so none of the pearl earrings match anything. are interesting. Check out these guys. They are shiny on the bottom, frosted like feathers on the top but with a pearl drop in the center and they're clips. What is happening? Hang on. You got out of the restaurant. I got it. Give me just a second, guys. She's ordering food. I am ordering food. (laughs) 
Dark has technically two cats and a dog. Is everything, yes, and I have one cat. Is everything, that's what everybody wants? I wanted to add his side. Okay, you do what you need to do, I'm done. I don't think these match anything. These little earrings that I just showed you all. Hoop ones with the little thing in the middle match the necklace I got earlier. Hoop ones. Hoop ones. Tell me which ones. These? The one you picked up. This one? These are clip-ons too. You want those, Isla? Do you want them? <coughs> those are the earrings you thought matched the one big necklace that had stones on it. No, I don't. I'm fine. All right. Um, the gold's a slightly different color. I can add them to the bag, but the gold's a little bit different color. Which set is that one? I have ones that look just like this in a different box. That Clip. might match that one. They're clips. We can pop them in here for her. Is she, what are, where are we at? We have to start a second bag for you, Islua. That's Gabby. This one's Islua. Hmm? This one's Islua. Okay, put Islua here. What's this? That's the really nice hand. Didn't we didn't find the other two. Okay. We're going to move Lucy over here so that I can keep track. <coughs> but that might be in with those stars. All right. <coughs> it's going to be fine. All right. So check it out. Anybody wants to know if they're if the pair is clip or if they're pierced or you want to know if something's marked. These are pierced swirls with rhinestones. I didn't sort them, sorry. I was just finding pairs. No, it's fine. Anything looks interesting in this box to anybody tell me. Um, all right. If you can't see something or you want me to stop, back up, anything like that, tell me. I'll move these around. These right here, by the way, have screw backs blue cabochons and rhinestones. The screw backs are, they have like a spring in them. Pretty sure those are a reproduction. You want those? Okay. Just letting you know they're not actually old screw backs. 
not with that spring in them. Okay. Blue stone. Carubia, which ones are you talking about? Is Lua asked for these blue stone ones? Bidding more, I know, right? Where's this Lua's bed? Is this this Lua? Mm -hmm. Yes. This is this Lua. Okay. Um, this is the wrong box. So these look like this. Just going to pick up some of these that are turned a little sideways. This is a little flower. Those are clips. These are basic gold hoops. These are gold hoops with green in them. These are gold hoops with cream and beige in them. This is some weirdness. I don't know what that is. Uh, gold hoops look like a bunch of combined wire. These are fabric. These red and yellow ones, they're strings, like Christmas ornaments. Um, regular little gold hoops. Gold wires. Screw backs, right? Uh, we have a lot of screw back earrings. So these ones you're gonna want to show some of these ones really good. That are actually old. I have to find for that in the studs compartment. Okay. You see it? Yeah. All right, so some of these are interesting. Yeah, there's some really cool All right, so these guys have like little little tassels that dangle. These are Monet. Yeah, they're Monet. These guys look like sand dollars. Little pierced flowers with a rhinestone in the center. These are plastic clips. I believe these have a pin that match. We're going to have to go look. These are the 80s business. <laughs> this is that woven wire rings. Set of big fatty pearls, 80s business. These are little uh, diamond chip studs with a 2D leaf. Do not have security backs on them. Uh, black and gold hoops that match all that black and gold chain. Hoops, 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 hoops. Some of those hoops have patterns on them. They do. But they're just gold hoops. Anybody's interested in gold hoops, tell me. This is like a loop thing. Those are domes pierced. These are plastic, purple stone pierced. Gold knots. This is a screw back. Uh, Napier, also with the tension spring, their reproduction. Huh? Alexa said, what you want? She liked hoops. You like the hoops? No, a person. Oh. The person liked the hoops. I think those bronzers we worn might go with that pineapple necklace pin, but maybe too dark for that. 
rhinestones, clips, not marked. These need to go with all of this black and gold chain. Burnished <laughs> leaf ones might go with the pineapple necklace pin, but maybe too dark for that. Burnished leaf what ones. The they match. Oh. So I want those to go together. Burnished leave ones. I want these. Boop over here. These. At the bottom of the box. Oh, these the two D leaves with the little diamond that are pierced. Am I struggling, S. Lua? Very lowest bit. Do you see it in frame? Left, middle, right? Okay. The ones next, these? Where my thumb's at? These are pierced too. These are kind of cool actually. They look like that. You like those? <laughs> those in a Slua's second bag. Miss Lua's ears aren't pierced. Those are pierced. Miss Lua, did you know that? I feel like I'm like I didn't put it in the bag as well. missing something. Hundred percent feel like I'm missing something. Okay. So these are good. This is all the plastic. It didn't go in anybody's bag. And then there's these really cool ones. Let me see. <coughs> All right. Cool. These are clip backs, clip backs. These are pierced with a little stone. 80s power lady, right? Plain gold pierced, gold hoops pierced. Look, fire. Um, black pierced. These are marked Lisner screwbacks. And I think you can see all of the other ones pretty good.
What's the dark blue? Is that pierced? The dark blue hoops are pierced? That dark blue? These are pierced, these are pierced. I think most of that box is pierced. Um, these are absolutely stunning. They're screwbacks. It's a clear plastic type leaf with rhinestones. <laughs> I don't see dark blue other than those hoops. She and they're pierced. Okay. I want you guys to see these. There you go. Those are cool. <coughs> There's a lot of gold hoops if you want to just go through the hoops. There's a lot. And they all have different like textures and styles and all of that. These are clips. I don't have them anywhere you can just show them anymore. They're all sets, though. Okay. I'll give you all the clips first. You want me to put both of them? Yeah, I want pairs. Mm -hmm. Good clips. These are Monet. Hi! I got stuff everywhere. These are not marked. So what we're doing is we're going through a ton of uh, vintage jewelry, everywhere from the 40s to the 2000s. These are marked AK. Um, AK. I'm putting them into one pound bags for 20 bucks and if you want to select the pieces that you want to go into your bag where's it marked inside these are Anne Klein and their clip-ons And then we're putting them up on Etsy so people can buy them. 20 bucks a pound for vintage jewelry. That's what we're doing today. So we're sorting it all out and then I'm gonna start bagging them up here in just a minute. The anclines are clip-ons. This is a three-piece set of Monet earrings and brooch. Gold burnished leaves. I can hold that, that way it's not good. That's alright, I got it. Oh, no, it doesn't go in here, because they were all together. Okay. Uh, these are pierced. They can, they can stay right there. Pearls. Oh, oh. It can stay right here. Okay, I can hand them to you. It's okay. These are hooks. These are hooks. Gold of the black uh, faceted stone. Not marked. A 
little chonky pierced hoops. This, maybe, it's, are these marked? They're not marked. Does anybody know what designer this is? Because we have quite a few pieces with this same branding. Sure. The silver flower one, sure. So like these earrings, this isn't marked either, <laughs> but it's that same, whoops, it's that same pattern, only it's etched in that pin. So I think the three of those ought to go together. Silver flowers, super detailed, these are clips. They're not marked, but they're super detailed. Oop, I just hit the camera. Like the centers are very three dimensional. I don't either, Bent. I want to say it's like a 1921 or something like that from the 80s, right? But I don't know. And we've got pierced knots. We have a little pierced red crown, pierced gold rose, pierced pearl, pierced rhinestone and pearl heart. I have the second earring to all of these, by the way. How oh, many earrings you guys will see are all, all pierced? Can I have those? You can, Lucy Lou. Yeah, all these earrings are in pairs. And then we've got these little black dangly dudes, very 80s, this little black and gold chevron. These go in Lucy Lou's bag. Uh, some scroll work. These are nice hoops. Uh, that's it for this box. Those are nice hoops. I don't think they're real gold, but they're nice hoops. The detail on them is very nice. <coughs> so there's those. That's it for that one. This one's mostly taken out. These are pierced through. Let me see. I'm just gonna. These are the only two left. And oh, what is okay. that? That's studs, and none of those have partners. Okay. Interesting. That's a shame. Okay. So this these don't have partners either? So these are all the studs that I have to go through. Yeah, I got that. And there are this is a partner, that's it. And then there's these. But yeah, none of those have partners. And then this one is also one we have to go through. Okay, hang on a second. These have a partner. <laughs> These have a partner. Okay. 
There might be a few. The majority of them do not. Okay. <coughs> All right. Most of those are clips. Most of these are clips. I'm surprised we haven't found more earrings that match these brooches. Like, it's shocking to me. These are all of these uh, tea stains. I can start pulling them out for you, but they're all very skewed. Okay, so this, no, no, don't pull them all out. It's fine. See this painted on gold? Don't pull them all out. Well, there's a bunch of different ones. I know. I've got a whole bunch of different ones like this in a bunch of different colors. And Does anybody those. like those? Want to see more of those kind? Welcome back, Alexa. The random posts. Yes, we're going to bring... Um, tell me if I'm... Ben, if I'm keeping you guys too long and you need to go, tell me and I'll stop what I'm doing, pull those out, and we'll go through them for you. Okay? Don't make me. No. Don't let me make you guys wait. Those are cool. These are cool. Um, pierced filigree fans that are puffed. They're the same on both sides. Okay, no hurry just yet. I just wanted to make sure. Random green 80s business. This lady was rocking it in the 80s. Gold twist rope hoop. These things are cool. The fan detail, right? It's nice. They're very, very light. These are clips. Beaded iridescent clips with a, um, it's not focused in any way. Focus. Hang on. Let's do that so you can actually see them. You want the blue clips? They're beaded. They spin. That's what the back looks like. So relaxing. Oh, that's nice. Where's the other one? Okay, this goes in Vince bag. Well, we're going to put this in Caribbean's bag. Well, I'll leave that in there. This is a cool set of earrings. Miss Lua? Oh, you asked for them. Son of a bitch. The blue ones? Yes, correct me. Yeah. I thought Bent said it. It's in the right bag. Hundred percent. Don't let me mess something up. Enamel pansy. These are just plastic pink squares. Plastic pink squares. These are all pierced in reds. You change your name color. Don't have to do that. These are clips that are, um, they're gold and cream. You're making a bracelet. That's your work today. Oh, that's nice. Scrooge McDuck only with jewelry instead of coins. Yeah, you can change your color. And we've got this green swirl. 
And we've got this kind of interesting teardrop business. Oh, I already showed you that one. Those are both pierced. These are um, a pierced blue drop with clear rhinestones. They're struggling in the box there. Yes, working from home in the winter is the best. I already got those two. I was moving up this way. Yeah. Little enamel center in that one. Did you like those ones, Lucy? The blue ones? The blue drops? She'll tell us. These are clips. Really, really nice detail. Rhinestone center. I don't know if these are marked or not. They are not. Uh, clip on gold teardrops, drop earrings. Yeah, but I don't want them. They're cool though, right? You don't have to want everything. <laughs> uh, these are stunning sunflowers. Gold clips, rhinestone in the center. Again, amazing detail on these. Right? You can just say you like it. That's okay. Uh, clips pearls with their teardrop pearls with diamonds surrounding them. Probably not pearls or diamonds. I want the sunflowers. You want the sunflowers, Lucy? All right, I got you. Um, big red 80s hoops or things, whatever these are. I don't know what these are. Um, gold teardrop and a pattern checkerboard enamel. My camera arm fell earlier. We had a whole moment. So it is much higher than it was earlier. Which is why we're now doing what we're doing. It was scary as fuck and now I'm just going to leave it alone. These are clip backs too. I just want to make sure anybody watching on mobile can see because that screen is so little, right? So I'm trying to give you guys the best real view that you can get. Red thing looks like lips, right? A uh, pair of leaf earrings. I believe these little leaves might have might have a brooch that matches. Let me see if I can find it. 
I know there's a few leafy brooches in here. Oh, hey. Here's that same, that same pattern again in another brooch. And this matches these earrings perfectly. I don't have a leafy brooch to match this one. Nope. I thought I did, but I don't. Anyway, here's these little, these little clip back leafy earrings. Oh my gosh, I can't afford to break this cam. I can't afford to replace it. I would lose my shit. These are really cute little maple leaf earrings. Clip backs. Uh, some, uh, bit or oak bit. leaves, whatever they're. So they want the oak leaves. <laughs> the last leaves that I just gave you. Which leaves? These. Well, you were showing those ones when I put it. Okay. No, there's stream delay. That's this one? Uh, yes. It's, yes. Uh, these are marked Giovanni, by the way. Go. Is that <laughs> brownstone uh, flower clip back earrings? <laughs> this is unique. These are really unique. What is this? Uh, Vendome? Vendome? Okay, so check this. Check this out. This is a clip back earring, but it has a screw back here at the top that like, why is it there? It pushes this part of the earring so you can adjust the metal. And it's on a spring. I've never seen the back of an earring look like that before. I've never seen them like that before. Isn't that weird? Y'all look those up. From where? I just found them. Oh, you just found them? Okay. The green stone ones are pierced. The pearls are clipped back. Right? Um, my mother has an antique store. Um, I've gone through antiques for 40 years. Big honking, super shiny rainstone clipbacks. Yeah, so those, see, so that one pair of earrings worth nine bucks a piece. This is like a unicorn colored guy.
clip back swirl earrings, uh, matte and shiny. We've got some more of these enamel guys from the 80s. Apparently she was very enamored with these things because we've got a lot of them. Right? She liked it, whatever. These are uh, clip backs. And they're really, really pretty dangles. Like, these are classy. Right? Everybody who survived the 80s has some of those. You like those, Miss Lewis? Yep. They're very classy. I think that's the end of that box. We're in this box. Several pairs, bright colors, right? The classy bitch bag. That's right. We have a gray plastic flower. That looks very sad. So if you would like earrings for sad days, this is them. <laughs> what? They do. They look sad. Oh, look. I thought these would be the same, Mom. Silver pierced hearts with hearts inside of them. You absolutely could. They're like rubber. You could paint them and they'd look cool. Uh, pierced. Looks like uh, three amethysts. There's an amethyst at the post around and then a teardrop. Yeah, absolutely. You could color them and they'd be really cute. They're just a very sad color right now. Well, these are gorgeous. Not marked, wires. Uh, ribbon above a oval cabochon with painted roses on it. You need the amethyst looking ones? They're pierced? Okay. Rubbery earrings that were still MRI safe. I could, well, other than the posts, I guess. But you can get them that have like the silicone posts. Wait, what is this? These are, well, these are your choice, okay? Uh, red faceted teardrop stone butterflies. Uh, do not have any earrings actually in them, so they could be pendants, could be pierced ears, could be hooks, depends on what you put with them. Converted. Little clip back uh, white enamel magnolias.
Lucy wants the butterflies. They're cute. Oh my goodness. That's no good. Uh, they're double leaf pierced hoops. It's dogwood. Thank you. Pierced gold uh, nugget jewelry. There's two sets, one larger, one smaller. That match. Yeah, I was talking to Ben earlier today. Been through so much. Uh, filigree and pearl pierced earrings. Right, 10 out of 10 would not recommend breaking your face. This is a little black daisy. I don't see black daisies. And a black and gold square. I kind of dig the black daisy. You can't see it because I'm flinging it all over the damn place, but I kind of dig it. They look like Ann Klein. Uh, neither of them are marked. They do, though. Um, oh my goodness, you guys. Uh, these are gold hoops that have a white cabochon in the front. They're clips. This is a pierced abstract leopard earring, I'm guessing. I don't know what that is. Who has all the cameos, isn't it? Because I just found the world's tiniest cameo earring. I believe the other one is in here. I think I put it in here. There you go. Are you sure? Uh-huh. I am. Put it in there. It's in here. I'm pretty sure. For Lucy. Lucy, you now have a set of um, tiny, tiny blue cameo earrings. A little gold um, dangle. You had one tiny cameo earring before. Now you have a set. Oh, this is pretty. It's a filigree teardrop set. They're pierced too. With like uh, maybe a lotus in the center. <laughs> no, I just put the second one in there. You now have a set. Uh, and then we have some standard like gold rope hoops in two sizes. And these weird squares. And I think that's it for this box. I think we hit everything. That's it for that box. The next box. By the way, uh, these I think are earrings. They don't have the things. And these are necklaces. Yes, these are little stone pendants that go with all the other ones. Two little baby leaf charms. Could be earrings if somebody wants to make them into them. 
They're kind of cute. They're um, like a burgundy coral and green. <laughs> like a fall leaf. I was looking for a Our order still got nine to ten minutes. I'm gonna pop those in there with those. All right, are we on our last box? Well, no. After that, I have studs to do. We'll go through the studs. Okay, so I have these cool, super cool. These are in two colors. Yeah, these are in two colors. Are these marked? These are not marked. Okay, so check this out. I have I have a full yellow set and a full green set, okay? But they've carved out Oh, you can see it on the yellow one right now. So they've carved out the background and then domed plastic glass, I don't know what it is, right, to make a cabochon look. But it's got all of this depth inside of it. And then it's got, this one has green and white rhinestones, that one has yellow and white rhinestones. Right? They're both clips. But I don't think, there you go. Now you can see it better. Aren't they cool? Bent wants them? I think they're really cool. I had not seen anything like those before. They're not marked. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, if you were going to redo them, they'd make gorgeous necklaces. Um, and then there's these guys, which are interesting. They're clips as well. They are marked. What are they? Right there. Um, they are marked West Germany. Well, that's a thing. West Germany. The last part of Germany. Well, it was East Germany and West Germany, right? Yeah, if somebody's looking to resell something. Right? They're marked West Germany. Here's what's interesting about them, okay? <laughs> is that they have this piece on the top that is clear glass, all right? It's painted in gold around it. It's got two pinky beige... Uh, rhinestones at the base. But what's interesting is there's no image on these. Normally when you see earrings like this, there's an image in the center of that and it's blank. I've never seen a pair blank before. There's a whole bunch of them that look like that. They're on that area. Yeah. Normally they have painted roses or, um, you know, people, stuff like that. <coughs> but those are blank. Uh, these are all pierced. So we've got two with pearls in them, one with a red cabochon, and then one with a green cabochon that's got flex in it. The red ones are plastic. They're not even metal. Just FYI. Hold on to those. Oh, I'm sorry. Hold on to what? Which ones? 
Are you telling me to hold on to the West German ones? I think so. The box of posts that I just gave you, or just showed you. You want to see them again? Hold this side. I think these are the four that I had. I've got another one very, very similar. Here, let me just pop this in here. I have another one that's super similar to those. Those are five different sets of earrings. <coughs> but I can pop them to the side for you if you want. I think he's telling you not to, not to get rid of them. Huh? I think he's telling you to hold on to them. No, I don't want these posts. It's just asking me to set them to the side. That's fine. Um, one of them is Mark Giovanni. One of them is a C in a circle. One of them is plastic. One of them is not marked. So they vary a little bit, but yes, let me pop them to the side for you. you just put them in that box. Hmm? I'm just going to set them right there like that. Pierce pearl with like a horseshoe shape gold around it. We got some uh, big girl earrings. Those are two different sets. They look almost alike. Big white earrings. And we have some smaller white earrings that look just like them. Clip dangles in a square, pierced, reverse teardrop, and clip knotted rope with chain tassels. I think we've all seen these before. That's that filigree wire work that's wrapped around a piece of gold. Gold dome clips. These are clip-on. Gold dome pierced. You can see my camera clearly. They're so shiny. Hello, camera. Pink wires, rainbow circles, yellow triangles, uh, these teardrops, possibly painted shell, feel more like shell than plastic, not real sure. The pink one feels like metal. Yep. She's not, she's not going away. <laughs> we don't know, maybe she was a lawyer. This way, I don't know how old she was in the 80s, but she was feeling herself, all right? <laughs> These are, well, that's just a little purple set. This red with the black center is interchangeable pierced earrings, so you can change them to red blue or green and then there's a purple diamond that's also plastic. I don't get what the thing was with the changing color earrings. You should have five of them. The pitch was that you, you only have to buy one pair of earring but you get like three because you can change colors. These are not pins, they are earrings. They are huge. I mean, I suppose they are clip-ons, so 
You know, if you wanted to get crazy <laughs> and <laughs> wear them as pasties, you probably could. <laughs> <laughs> I don't recommend it. They probably hurt. <laughs> uh, these are little uh, silver and gold pierced earrings. They're very classy looking. That could potentially be our food, which would be excellent because I am fucking starving. Uh... Draped ropes. These are pierced. Oh, are these marked? These are not marked. Oh, they are marked. They're marked art. Copyright. <laughs> Clip back, very, very, very nice rose earrings. Yeah, we will, we will give treats to Shira. <laughs> These rose earrings, by the way, do not match this, but they are very close to these rose pins. Come here, Shira, Shira. You want some treats? You want some treats? Can Trax have some, please? You can't eat them all. Trax has to have some. Trax gets treats. Even though he's chonky, he still gets treats. You have to share. Yeah, they're really cool, though. Um, screw back. Unmarked. We're going to eat because I'm freaking starving. Screw back unmarked enamel painted. Yeah, I'm going to sit in here and eat. It's fine. Bring it up here. Check these out, guys. They have a little pearl in the flower. They're screwbacks. You want those, this Lua? They're really nice. Tiny grapefruit. You want the rose earrings. Do you want the pins that match them too? Well, they don't match. They're not perfectly matched. But do you want the two pins with them? Lucy? Get your mouth away from my potatoes. Bye. You want some potatoes? Hi, Emma. Um, there was a friend of mine's boyfriend's grandmother passed away, uh, and this is part of her estate. So they brought me a tote of all of her jewelry from the 40s to 2000s. These are very, very 60s. Clipbacks, rhinestones, pearls in the center. And hi. These are pretty. <clears throat> uh, clip backs, they're frosted with one little shiny piece in the center of that open circle. These are 
These are really pretty. I love it when earrings like go two different ways so that when you wear them, right, there's a left and a right. That is so pretty. Little green plastic shell looking studs. Uh, pearl gold and rhinestone clip. Half pearl screw back. Nope. Okay, you can get in the chair. These are the reimagined screw back clips uh, from Napier, which we have seen. <laughs> it's a half hoop in gold. Hold the clip. Pearl clip-ons. I'll put. I'm just gonna put those in a little pile right there for you. These are clips. So the blue is a clip, the pink is pierced, goodie bag welcome, thanks for following, yeah I got you, I knew the ones you meant, Ben. So these are pierced, that's a clip. This clip is interesting though. Uh, marked Sarah Covington. Such a strange shape. You want the pink one too? These little clips are Monet with that classic Monet clip back. A frosted gold. Gold of filigree reverse teardrop dangles. So for anybody just coming in, what we're doing is I am showing all of these individual pieces. These are pierced. Hashtag big ass earrings. Um, okay, it's Lua. People are selecting what they like to go into their bags. I'm selling this jewelry all at $20 a pound, which is 0.45 kilograms if you're not American. So people are able to select what they want in their bags. And then when we are done with this, I will be filling all of the rest of the bags, about 30 of them. So I have about 36 pounds of jewelry. These are pierced. It's like a rope around the edge that makes a flower. They're kind of interesting. These are clips. If you're an 80s power attorney, I got something for you.
These are earrings as well, clip backs. They're dogwood, right? Enamel with a very three-dimensional center. I don't know how well you guys can see that. You want these bent? Or you're just telling me, yes, I got the flower right this time. These are also clips. We've got teardrop shaped cabochons in a green, blue, red and blue coral, uh, some iridescent rhinestones and pearls. They're certainly interesting color wise. You want those? Uh, and then I got a bunch of little, these little guys. Okay, so that's a tiny clip back, coral cabochon. How well you guys could see that I'm doing my wrong hand and I've got my glasses on. Right? This is pierced. Um, a turquoise bead in this, well, round cabochon, whatever, in the center. Pearl and amethyst rhinestones, stones around the outside. Man, you can't see that. Where's my little paper? Where's my little paper I've been cheating with this whole time? Oh, here it is. Is that color better? These are pierced. And then I've got some black round posts and I've got some tiny, tiny hoops in there. These are pierced. Um, Bent, did you take plastic or enamel? Um, plastic. It's absolutely not enamel. Like there's there's a depth to it. It looks like it's a set stone. Feels like glass, but I'm 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 betting it's plastic. <clears throat> I think these match that necklace that I put in your bag earlier, Bent. Is that right? Is this the ones that I was looking for? <laughs> yeah? Okay, good. They're pierced, by the way. <clears throat> Clip round rope earrings. Oh, you don't have to take them. I didn't have to put them in there. I'm sorry. You don't have to take them if you don't want them. <laughs> I didn't even ask, did I? I just was like, yep, you get these. These match your shit. That's what you get. You don't have to take them. <laughs> I 
everything. <laughs> hey, Tiny Grapefruit, thanks for following. Appreciate you. Uh, here we have a matching leaf and clip. So we have a matching brooch and clip earrings. You want that set us, Lua? Oh, I see. Okay, Ben. <laughs> I just wasn't trying to force somebody into doing something they didn't want. Take 10 minutes and eat, please. Okay, I can do that. I was just trying to get through this box, Gabby. I've been going for five hours. That's true. I only have two more pair of earrings in this box, and we're through it. And then it would be a great time to take a little break and eat. I appreciate you watch it out for me. It's a heart with like a rope through it. And I am absolutely ravenous. Uh, these clip-on earrings match that really cool um, necklace that somebody got earlier. But these are pink in the center instead of brown. Right. I will in just a second. We're almost there. Who got that necklace? And do you want a pair of earrings that that look like it. I wonder if these are marked because that necklace wasn't marked. They're not either. These are so interesting and the stones are cat's eyes. All right, last pair, last pair in this box. It was me! Do you want those earrings, Lucy? I mean, they're, they're the same. They're just pink in the center instead of brown for the necklace. And they're clips. Those last earrings were teardrop, yes, but go eat. They were not teardrops. Oh, the, the little heart guys? These guys? Miss Lua? No? Oh, you're talking about these. If you want it, you'll pass on them. Okay, Lucy. You're talking about those. If they were teardrops, you'd get them? Yeah. All right, I'm gonna sit here and uh, boot this cat off my chair. We have two more boxes of earrings. I have to do studs for bent, and then we're gonna go through those brooches, and then I'm gonna start building bags. That's the plan. But first, I'm gonna sit right here in front of you and I'm gonna eat something. Oh my God, y'all. Would you rather I not? I can put on words on stream and you guys can play words on stream for a minute and I can go sit downstairs and eat if you'd rather not watch me eat live on stream because I know that bothers some people. Build the bags, right? So if it bothers anybody, tell me. And I'll put you guys on words on stream and you won't even have to see it. You won't even have to watch me. You won't even have to see me. How much does your bag currently weigh? You have one pound and six ounces. So you got about a pound and a, what? Just over a third. Something like that. Two 
two more streams open. You can check in on others, right? Everybody's always, always jumping stream to stream. I do the same thing. Trying to support as many people as you can at the same time. We can do both. I can put on words on stream. And we can play words on stream. And I can sit here and eat. We can do both things. Just have to be quick with the jewelry. Well, apparently you're not wrong. I'm not, I'm not going to say you're wrong because you're 100% not wrong. I'm going to scoot you over here. I'm going to scoot you over there. You can look at the other dirty part of my, my studio that is uh, <laughs> full of more jewelry all over the floor. But we're doing good. We've made progress. Any acorns want? You want anything with acorns on it? Is that what you're saying, Bet? Just that, guys. I'm going to call my daughter.
You don't have to be good at it. It's just a way to pass the time so you're not just sitting there staring at me eating. <laughs> I do wish that it would tell you the ones that you missed so you'd know what the words were. You know, so I could le learn something. Yes, Lua, good job. for him. Checo got mourn. Oh my god, y'all. I'm freaking starving. Gabby was right. I can't eat fast enough. I am so hungry. I know, right? I have to like concentrate to eat slower because it's not good for me. So if anybody is new to this, right now all of you can guess. So as Lua has put a word in and she has a lock next to her name, we have to wait for that little bar across the top where the lock's at to unlock and the locks to disappear by our name and now we can put in the second word. It slows you down so everybody gets a chance.
Yeah, Dark just didn't want to eat in front of you guys. I had salmon. So he went downstairs and... Went in my room. Or went in your room. Dark had salmon for dinner. I had grilled salmon, broccoli, and then two servings of potatoes and bacon. (laughs) (laughs) Grilled salmon, broccoli, and two servings of potatoes with bacon. All right, I'm going to go put the rest of my food in the refrigerator. Skull. And I'll be right back.
All right, y'all. Whew. I feel better. You're still going? You're on level 10? Look at you. One more word and you guys got it. Kecko got it. You're doing good. <laughs> oh, it was already taken. You guys are doing a good job. You got the two biggest words. It was really funny. I put it uh, wrong. Oh, yeah. And I put a U instead of an A. And then I Hummer. It, yeah, and then I immediately put an hammer. <laughs> and real quick, I'll also put a hammer, but I got it. <laughs> All right, so we have the last of these. So these are all mismatched earrings. They don't have mates? No, some of these have mates. Dark, tell me what, what's what here. These are all mated. These are all not. Those have no partners. These all do. And uh, the ones in these individual ones do too. They're all studded partners. So these all have partners too. But the rest are random? Yeah, I don't know if any of these have partners. I haven't finished looking through them. Okay. They're studs that aren't. Right. Hmm. Are we still going? Yeah, I mean, you could take it off any time. Oh my gosh, you guys want to, well, let them keep going. You got to keep going. You can't just stop in the middle of it. Fake letter and a hidden letter. Here, let me sit down. Whew, my tummy's full. H is fake.
We made it. Okay, Vent. Hidden letter is E. Fake letter has to be J. Slow took my word. Last seconds. Sneaking in there. Look at this Lua and Kecko. My goodness. Y'all are killing it. We're almost done. As soon as we finish this game, we'll get back to what we were doing. Fake letter and a hidden letter. isn't it accepting my word. That's a word. Oh, five letters or more. That's why. No pressure. What's up, Phyllis? Mongoose. Nice. Oh my gosh, one more point, you guys. One more point. Whew. We got it. I snuck in there last second. <laughs> that was close. Is Lewis still killing it? Look at this. Look at Islu and Kecko so far away from everybody else.
right? I know, I panic. I'm like, oh, I don't know anything. Five letters or more. Oh my gosh. H this this H does not help me in any way. Goldfish. Damn it. Oh my God, I got it. I mean, I'm way too late. <laughs> oh. That was rough. GG's though, you guys did a good job. Thanks for letting me have my dinner. I appreciate it. I was legit starving. I had to force myself to slow down. I had chicken tenders and a baked potatoes and it was so good. Okay, Keki. Keko. Keki. All right. <laughs> okay, studs. I don't even know what to tell you on these studs. Uh, let's go through the sets that I do have, and then we'll talk about the singles. I have a set of these bad boys right here. Pink plastic. I have a set of a uh, grain of faith mustard seeds. Those are not mated, those are not mated, those are not mated. I have a little pearl pierced earring stud with a gold orchid dangle. Gabby said she wants to meet a face. Okay. Uh, solitaire looks to be about one carat. It's a rhinestone set in silver, highly tarnished, no security back. That was this is for Gabby. Oh, update on uh, the cats. Tracks is now bigger than uh, beta. Tracks is now bigger than beta. Um, Pierce stud, 
gold rope, black antiquing, red stone in the center, faceted. Oh, better living through chemistry. Plain gold dome, little button stud. All of these have mates, by the way. Derwood said that for <laughs> What's up, Derwood? Um, oval pearl, uh, that is like um, a zigzag cut gold around the edge. It's not rhinestones. How you doing, Derwood? Do you care? Sarah Coventry? No. Is this a match set? No, it's not. I just like it. It's a little tie. Oh. These are matches. These are matches. Large three pearl piece. Pierced. Did you already White know? flower one. If it's a pair, stick it in my bag, please. White flower. This? Is this what you're talking about? Clip back, white and silver flower, not a pair. Yeah, it's not a pair. Did you already pull these out? I have not. Green and yellow enamel daisy pierced. I did those. These are. Um, somebody has the brooch that matches this. You want the daisies? Okay, I got you. Um, somebody has the brooch that matches this. This is a single earring. There's not two. It's screw back. Do you want this as well? Gabby's bag that we're working on is the grain of faith ones. What are you doing? Let me see them. Yes, that's what she means. Blurry, sorry. This is a single black faceted heart with rhinestones around it. Does not have a mate. Um, and then we have, so that's that box's mates. Yep. No, I didn't do these. These are pierced. Did you do the hearts? Earrings with a matching necklace. Black heart? Okay. It's just a single one. You can cut that off and make this It's really pretty. No, but I want these three together. You can put them in here if you want. It's all right. They're going to go in bags in just a second. That yeah, black heart goes in Lucy's. Mm -hmm. This is Lucy, right. Three little dangly gold hearts. Pierced. Like a button for a shirt. Very fancy shirt. You're probably right, Ben. Did you do these ones? Mm-hmm. Those are 
같은 거. 하나 더 있었어. This is also a single screw back. Um, black glass cabochon, hand painted rose. Tie clip, 10 karat gold, uh, two emeralds. It's going to go in the dress up your boy bag. There's also these. But one's blue and one's green. I don't know what they are. These are earrings. Or pins. They're not earrings. They're no. Pins. These are pins. And they're <laughs> also 10 karat. They're from General Motors, and it's for so many years of service. One's, one's emeralds and one's sapphires. So we're going to put that in the dress up your boy, which is over here. Yeah, the dress up your boy bag. Dress up your boy. This is neat. Which has more gold in it than uh, anything. So, this is a new pen. What does it say? Retired, but, Retired but not tired RSVP pen. Okay. <laughs> so I'm weird. Retired. So weird. Retired member of the UAW pen. Okay. I'm not getting into all that. All right. This is, why would there be three of these? It's not, I looked at them, that one's slightly different than the other two. Is it? Yes. So weird. Open that back up. Okay. These are all singles, right? Yeah. Uh, this matches, did somebody take that bracelet? No, that matches that bracelet. What's, these are not, these are, do not have mates. <coughs> Hot monsters! Oh my gosh. What? Oh my gosh! What just happened? He just gifted 10 subs. What are you doing? On the wrong channel. Hunt, are you okay? He's not on the wrong channel. He's so crazy. Tracks, buddy, get out of my chair. Thank you. Oh, good, you got one. And Lucy got one. Thank you so much, Hunt. I appreciate you, man. All right, now we have itty bitty little earrings, okay? So I'm gonna hold these up, and if anybody is interested in itty bitty little earrings, here's what we have. I can't even, I can't keep up, you're scaring me. I'm trying to Boy, Backstreet Boys album, not give subs. I was trying to boy the Backstreet Boys. Were you now? Were you, Hunt? Tell us more. <laughs> I'm gonna need to hear this whole story about you boy and the Backstreet Boys. Right? Are they aware this is a thing? Do they even know? I'm going to at somebody on Twitter any minute. Okay. I'm going to attempt to do this this way. 
It was pretty good though, right? Cool. All right, so we have little oval pearls. Um, we have little gold hoops, little gold knots, little pink flowers with pearls in them, gold roses, pink cupcake things, those little pink roses. They're little roses with, no, they're not. They're not pearls, I'm sorry. They're little gold, they're little gold, um, little gold studs. Pop these in Gabby's bag for me. Um, we have uh, emerald cut rhinestones. We have a gold square with an amethyst in the center. Little red ones. These little guys. More gift subs. More gift subs? Yeah, what? Uh, it's Lua. Yeah. Gabby, here's a pair of little. Um, and then Hunt said, This is a cat meeting. Little blue ones, too. Did you find a boy? <laughs> <laughs> no more cats. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Hunt, thank you so much. <laughs> Gabby wants the little. Everybody has a kitty now, they're all different colors. So many cats. Yes, everybody has beta cats, except for Hunt has a special beta cat. He gets beta cat with a little star by him. Um, here's our gold roses. Hunt said never found the boy. <laughs> <laughs> Never gonna find your boy. Never gonna be your boy. And never gonna be your boy. Um, we have these little red guys over here. Can I get the gold roses, Islua? Islua wants the gold roses. There's a single gold rose that doesn't have a partner that's slightly bigger than these if you want offset roses. You never know. Don't be judgy, judgy people. I was just um, these are silver rounds with hearts in them. Skull. Okay. These are all pierced, yep. by the way. These are little gold button rounds with like etched leaves on top of them. And then we have all of these. These are a variety of colored, non-colored rhinestones, pearls. It's my room. I can do what I want. I can't see any. I can't see any with a security back on them. There's a pair of piercing studs in here. These are all of the little studs. I have not partnered yet. Some have partners, some may not. Some are just beads. It's my rose. I can do what I want. Oh, and crack me up. Oh, my gosh. The third rose. There's the um, third rose. I'm going to say there's around 30, 35 studs in here. Anybody interested in those? You guys just want a bag of mystery studs? <laughs> Are these non-match studs? 
That's a gold set stud with a security back on it. We'll throw that in there. Here's a bigger brown boy that can go in there. That's a pair now. Do those really sound secure, Brad? No, I mean, okay, so when you, when you buy diamond stud earrings that are, you know, 10 to 24 karat gold, they come with secure backs. So the posts themselves are, are shaped different so that the back of the earring stays on because they're valuable. Right, so costume jewelry doesn't have that. So I look for the back of the post to see if they have the secure back. Like, um, for instance, oh, you one piercing, one? no. Piercing studs are shaped differently on the back than regular studs. Let me see if I can. So there's two ridges there and then a point because it's a piercing stud, right? And then this is straight and then has a tiny indentation there. It's a good indicator on unmarked earrings, whether or not they're actually <laughs> precious metals, real gemstones. Are you talking about that weird ridge in them? Mm-hmm or they'll have screws on the backs. Okay. So Ben said, if no takers, I'll take them and use them to adjust ribbons and feathers. Yeah. And such on hats. I mean, a lot of those don't have partners, or they do. Fit. And I think there's like what, 20 in there? No, there's about 35, 36 in here. Individual little studs. They're all tiny. Um, I'm just picking up what's in here. So you're going to get like some earring backs and some random business too, okay? You could use them like that. Right. She wouldn't necessarily need partners for Right. Do you want any of the other small ones? Like, do you just want the studs? Hey, you want to them first? Right, they, yeah, I got what you're saying. Because I can just dump this whole box in there and that would be fine with me if you really want to. <laughs> I mean, just saying. Because there's these little studs, too, that are just... Oh, yeah, look. Put those in there. I mean, do you want to add these bags in there? No. There's a bunch in there. I don't want to give them a bunch of stuff that they can't use. Like, that's not... The whole, whole point of this is that people could pick out what they got, not that I just, like, throw shit in their bags. <laughs> Just the studs. The decorator studs that are set aside. Okay. Do you want me to tell you where you're at weight wise? We're on bag two. And you're only at five ounces. You know what I mean? So you can easily fit all of these in your bag that you're working on right now. Um, so you have eight sets 
This one is plastic. All the rest of these are metals. The top three are very similar with pearl. This is a smaller size pearl. This one is pink. The far one is that unique multicolored with the rhinestones. And then this is a green, if that helps you. Right? We're, the only thing we have left to do is brooches. And then I am begging this is these. Part of the pirate booty treasure. Okay. Um. That's this one, right? Yes. Now go weigh that. Nine point two. Yeah. So you're only at nine point two ounces with all that in there. So you're doing good. All right. Stack these over here. And let's talk about brooches. I don't know why I keep sitting down. I can't sit down. You're about to hit it again. I see it. Nice gold filigree bow. Cool detail on it. Um, not marked. Just a second. Another bow. I could put them with the Christmas set. I'll take that one and the rose. This bow, Lucy, or the first bow? <laughs> and the rose. Oh, the yellow roses? Or the pink roses. Tiny grapefruit wanted it. I'm lost. I've, I've missed something, guys. I know I said no before, but Tiny Grapefruit wanted it. The first bow. Okay. Did I miss getting something to somebody? Okay, so there is a yellow rose set. There's a coral rose set. Do you want just the yellow? Or do you want both? <laughs> oh, that's nice. This goes for Lucy. <laughs> and the coral, too. Uh, yeah, this is a slua here. Lucy's bags are here. Um, one more bow. Gold mesh bow with pearls and leaves because why not put all the shit in one pin? I like all these things. I would like them combined immediately, please. Super shiny bow. Would I be like the worst salesman on QVC ever? <laughs> tiny bow. Oh. And one little gold tiny bow.
And we're through the bows. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. This is broken. It's a random flower. It's very gritty to the touch. I don't like it. This piece. This piece displeases me. This piece displeases me. It's gritty. You should feel this one. I, I don't, I don't mind that feel one. Feel the pear with this one is cute. Leaves. It's cute. I don't like the leaves. It's so cute. It's a pear. Giant leaves. I like it. Pear leaves are not bigger than the pear itself. Yes, they are. Know. It's I a like baby that. pear. Mm. Do you think pears are just born gigantic? They gotta be babies first. Not little leaves like that. Why are you going so weird and out of order? I'm not. That was literally the next one. No, it's not. The strawberry. The Golden Strawberry Award goes to <laughs> <laughs> a raspberry. <laughs> it's supposed to be raspberry, not strawberry. <laughs> the Golden Strawberry Award. Is that that doesn't work? <laughs> Is there any more fruit? This is what the jewelry has to say to me about my uh, golden strawberry war. You want the pear? My jewelry says K. Okay. The pear disagreed. Uh, this is a locket. This is a necklace. Oh, it's a pendant. Nice. This is a locket. It's a plain locket with a bow. There's my camera shining. It's very shiny. That's the one I thought you were originally talking about. Oh. That does not match those earrings. There's an apple. You want the K? K. <laughs> this goes to Lucy. Right? I'd like the apple. Who wants the apple? Isla. Isla wants the apple? Yeah, I cut myself. You can have, don't bleed on Isla's apple. Oh no, I didn't draw blood. I like punctured through my skin. Uh, rainbow rhinestone peacock looking thing. Wow, this looks so dark. Why does it, it's so dark because my, I set this camera up originally like a foot over and my lights are not hitting it here. These stones are not this dark. They're much lighter. Amalgamation thing earlier. These ones are all closed if you wanna grab these. Okay. Look at this. Do you see this? You can wear this on your collar if you're somebody that people call stewardess and not flight attendant because the word flight attendant didn't exist. So, I want the collar thing. I want to be a power woman of the 80s. It's Lua. This is weird. It's got a It's thing fancy, to, bitch. It's got a thing to be a necklace, but somebody made It's a it glasses in. holder. I love it. Oh, it's both. Mhm. Mm There's a lot that's both. Oh, this is interesting. It doesn't open. I thought it was another perfume holder. It's very dimensional. It can be hung from a necklace or worn as a pin. It's unmarked. But it's very deep. This one is very tall. Right? It's very tall. Bet wants it. Mm-hmm. Not 
the ones up here that I don't do? Don't, don't tell me what to do. Uh, this one, very similar to the last one, only very flat. Although it is very pretty. Right, it's, <laughs> it's okay. I would rather you guys get what you want, right? You get first pick. Tiny bow. You guys are important. What are you wanting? Here is a small bow with a white mother of pearl thing ish under it. Oh, you want that flat one too? It is a nice one. It really is. I like that one. Now I want brioche. I freaking love brioche bread. You like it in French toast form? <laughs> Pearls and ribbons in matte gold. It's like a weird octopus. It does look a little bit like a weird octopus. I was talking about the one I would put down. So Hat band pins. Nice. Does this also have rhinestones? This also has tiny rhinestones around the edge of those pearls. And it's Trafari. Apple with matching earrings. These are cool to me. These are, um, the earrings are pierced. They're apples. They're Sarah Coventry. And it's a frosted plastic with a gold background, but they've colored it so that it like shines green and like a pinky red color. And it's got little earrings that match. Can I get those two with my other apple? Yes, it's Lua, you can have all the apples. Miss Lua must have all the apples. That's fine. I think these are really pretty. Have the apples. I like the color. Um, these are set. They look like they're trying to mimic Alexanderite, lighter than amethyst, with um, wire filigree. So, in the camera right now, it looks like those are beads. They're not. They're set stones. It is very delicate. What's up, Billist? Guide the raid? Who are we raiding? Who do you want to raid? Um, is this marked? This is not marked. Rhinestones and gold missing three stones. Uh, thing in my bag. Okay. okay. This looks very much like it might have belonged to Cruella DeVille. That's what I'm saying. It looks like a weird octopus. <laughs> it does. Doesn't it? Cruella <laughs> DeVille. Cruella DeVille. If she doesn't scare you. Yes, they will. I can't remember the song. Sea urchin. Right. Um, can you put this in Gabby's bag? Ursula, right? Ursula doesn't have as good of a song. What are you talking about? Poor unfortunate souls. It's Ursula's song. I don't like that song. I do. Why are you? What's the requirements? For, For what? You want a bag of jewelry, Illus? That's uh, Iceman. That's Illus. Oh. Talking like I don't know who he is. Oh. This has got like a crest in the center of it. Or for raids? I don't know. You want me to raid somebody? We'll raid somebody. Illus is like, uh, Mrs. <laughs> Stop. Stop streaming, Mrs. Right now, go and raid somebody. Nobody wants to see you anymore. I just push buttons. 
this is okay I need this camera to focus need to be a gold member in this cult can't go any higher I'll hit the camera there we go this is a cool one because this is a very very particular type of metal working Bent has probably seen it before. Mm -hmm. uh, Very fine. Spanish, I think. Mm -hmm. Pearls. Pearls, pearls, pearls. Spanish. Spinach. Mm hmm. This is very heavy. It's weird. I like the stone in it though. But it's got like that loop doesn't belong there. Like I don't. Oh! It's a heart. I didn't know it was a heart. Doesn't mean I can see it like that. This is another one of those collar ones that you wear. Still. Hey, Foxy. Filing my nail. Uh, filing my nail. Oh. <laughs> Everybody. Ooh. Everybody. Ooh. Said, is it a ring? These are all brooches. We're finishing up with brooches right now. Nice collar pin. <laughs> you want that one? Bent wants that one. Let's see what you're at. Where did you get all of this, Foxy? See this? This is for them old bitches playing Resident yeah. Evil. Right there, that's what that is. Oh, Foxy. Look at it. Does that not look like a biohazard sign out of pearls? <laughs> During the apocalypse. I freaking them, love it though. All them old ladies. Is there a mark on it? You gonna answer, Foxy? There is not a mark on it. A friend of mine's fiance's grandmother passed away, and this was all part of the state, so uh, I inherited about 36-ish pounds of vintage jewelry from the 40s to the 2000s. No mark bent. You want it? <laughs> That's really Resident Evil. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is pearl and gold. It is missing three emerald cut rhinestones. And here we are back up to your so. your 80s vampire protection. <laughs> <laughs> so, or if you are a ain't vampire, nobody biting me with this on my neck. If you are a vampire, you can wear that. Look fancy. Don't think I didn't look like a vampire wearing this kind of shit in the 80s because I 100% did. That can keep your cloak attached. Right? <laughs> This is a very, very pretty one. I really like this one. It's a ribbon wreath with uh, green emeralds and they're barrel cut. Buffy the Grandpire. <laughs> oh my God. Are all vampires just grandparents? I can't. They're all like thousands of years old. This green is much lighter when it's not sitting on this black. Here. But I like that one. Mm -hmm. It looks like Peridot. Right? It's peridot. I got it. It's peridot color. Gabby wants it. Um, this little Ursula piece is missing a couple of legs. Do you still have the pair? So. No. The pair? Yes, I have the pair. Lucy, you want a pair? Do you want the strawberry too? It's a pair for Lucy. Lucy's right. 
Once again, we will revisit what goes on your neck. This has three chains that hang down from it as well. Are you going through them? A pair of pairs. Um, I am getting rid of them. Okay, so right now I am showing everybody every single piece. We are, what, what am I in? Six hours in? How long have I been going? One. Six and a half hours just to show all the pieces. That's the Titanic Pearl. Okay. Weight and finish of the pearls. They are very, very lightweight. This, this piece is super, super tarnished. It's been through some shit. It was on the Titanic Pearl. I'm joking. Somebody else said that. Um, yeah, just to show each individual piece. So the goal here. Let me wait. Oh, no, Lucy doesn't want it, and he doesn't want it either. Um, the goal here is that I am creating one pound bags, right, that are $20 a bag. I wanted to give my community, there is a single rhinestone on this. I wanted to give my community an opportunity to pick through this first so they can choose what goes in their bags, which is what they're doing right now. Uh, and then here in just a minute, as soon as we get done with these brooches, uh, I'm going to start making bags. We're going to throw these up on Etsy. And everybody who has selected a bag, that's a pearl. Everybody who's selected a bag gets their name put into the Etsy store with, as a variation and they can go pay for their name and then they'll get the exact bag that they asked for with whatever they want in it. So you get a pound of vintage jewelry for 20 bucks today from me. It is 100% in a weird place. Father of Pearl gets no love. You know, hunt, not everybody knows. Not everybody knows their daddy, and that's okay. <laughs> All right. I don't know why you why you're why you're judging on that. This is a heart from the Variety Club. That's the reflection like the of my camera. Too, please, strawberry. Strawberry. <laughs> Lucy, you ate all my fruit. Huh? And last but not least. This angel. It actually dings. With a bell that moves. It actually dings. <laughs> Hunt, do you need this? So you can come into my stream and be like, ding, 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 What, you want it? <laughs> All right. Ah. Uh, I don't know where Hunt's bag is. Hunt doesn't have a bag. Hunt wants one piece. Hunt wants this angel, because Hunt's an angel baby. I want it. <laughs> Hunt's an angel baby. It's OK, because you're going to see some stuff here in just a second. You can ask I me. Like I, a lot, like I just wrote angel. I just wrote angel. <laughs> Do you see this? <laughs> Instead of hunt monsters, I wrote angel. <laughs> Just put monster under it. Angel monster. Slash devil. <laughs> Hunt's ketchup. That's your new name. That's your name right there. You see that? That's you. <laughs> okay, rings. Rings, rings, rings. Um, no, it's all right. Okay, we're going to go through these rings real quick. This is a ring that has its, well, okay, there's no light here. We don't, we don't need any light. What's happening? It's a little better. It's got magnets in it, right?
That's a um, matte gold ring that's been carved out so it's shiny. I just threw a ring across the room. Big, big honka honka 80s ring. Right? Tungsten ring. Tungsten ring style, exactly. I need to turn this this way so that the light hits this thing right because I can't, I can't take it. Okay, there we go, that's better. That is uh, a weave with a chip of diamond in the center. Chonky. Chonky like my cat. Silver, three mother of pearl discs. I have no idea on the sizing of these rings. If I were to guess, I would tell you 90% of them are probably around size seven. This is a um, marquee setting that is empty. What? This one's about a seven because my finger's five and a half. Yes, that's what I'm saying. They're all about a seven. No marks. Not one of these rings has a mark. Okay, this one's a five. Uh, this one is missing two diamonds, rhinestones, whatever they are. You are not the father, said Mari, to the pearl. Okay, that's wicked. That's the only one that I actually fits me. Two pearls? This is set in gold, too, by the way. Thanks, Mercy. What's up? Giganto pearl? Like dog. It actually does, Hunt. I like it. But I have a June birthday. So that was my birthstone for a long time. This bad boy. This is what you use when you're in a dark alley. Those are all rhinestones around a very egg-shaped piece of coral. The two pearl in the bag, okay. Can you put that in Vince's bag, that one right there? That's a five and a half. So, just for the big single pearl, sure. Just for perspective, like, I can go all the way into your eye socket, okay? I'm not just going to like hit you in the eye. I can go all the way in there. That's what that's about. It's a very violent ring. Big Pearl. Lucy. Lucy. You want to know you're at, Lucy? <laughs> it is huge, okay? I'm serious, it really could. 9.5. Um, maybe I don't need this. I need to fix my light. Uh, gold band breaks into three bands on the top, three stones. Very, very beat up, this band. 80s power attorney wore this because it's got wear across the front, so she was either, you know, knocking one out or something because there's wear in there. Waiting. Wanting the weave with the chip in it in case you missed it. I did miss it. Foxy. Yeah, you have to tell me if I miss stuff because it's hard for me because I'm not facing Sorry, I'm not I'm, facing the computer. I'm trying to watch it. 
Foxy, what did you want? The weave with the, chip. with the diamond chip. Okay. I think you mean this one, Foxy. 100%, you guys, repeat yourselves. If I'm, I'm not trying to ignore anybody, I'm just missing stuff. Is this the one that you wanted? And like, you can tell me over and over again, and I'm never gonna get mad at you, I promise. <laughs> this is for Foxy. Got you. Unbelievable. You're all right. Um, this has five diamond chips in a wave pattern. Right, Islua? Lots of wear on the band of this one. You want the wave? They are all costume, okay? Mercy I mean, the mama witch? Yes. My urge to just somehow appear and be... <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to come steal everything. Uh, this is a little filigree with some leaf work and then <laughs> a flower in the center it's that has like a diamond. She got drunk and she got her to <laughs> Lord Asset, he's okay and alive. Chest infection. That's not good. Oh, well, I'm, gl I'm glad he's okay. She's talking about Obi Burt Kenobi. For those of you that don't know, he's been sick. The flower one is Slua. Your costume major. Oh, well, perfect. See, you came to the right place. We have a lot. Uh, that's a, looks like a blue sapphire, diamonds around it, right? None of these are real stones, I don't think. None of these have marks. You'll take that one. Are you talking about this one? Oh, you were talking about the flower one. I'm sorry. Oh, I lied to you. This one is marked. I do have one ring that's marked. I'm sorry, I forgot. I said I like that one. Uh, this, that's supposed to look like maybe a tortoise shell, uh, is Sarah Coventry. It's got a matte ring around this stone, and then the band itself is shiny. But it is Mark Sever Coventry. It's possible. I don't know what it is. It's not painted. I'll take that. Lucy. Mm. Bent, I'm going to say it's probably art glass. <laughs> it looks like mixed art glass. It looks like it's been made, not... It's been created. You know what I mean? Uh, ruby with um, diamonds. It's actually set like it's real stone. Don't think it's real oh, stone. Ruby said the collage style one you had. Can I see it again? Collage style. Sure. So it's a big cocktail ring. Collage style. I think maybe a garnet. Foxy said I'll take the It's ruby pretty one. light. 
You can't see how light it is in that camera because my lights are facing over here, but it's possible. This one? Yep. The ruby one. Spin a Oh, you know what? You might be right. Um, the collage style one you had, I don't know what you mean. I think it was the one right before the turtle one. <laughs> and then there's this classic, everybody's mother had this ring. I've got that one. University school got you. College, I understand. I read it as collage, I apologize. Here, let me show you in this. Let me show you in this camera. Sold. I, th I think you can see the, the details better. Sold. Sold. She's talking about this one. You want this one? Is what she meant sold for. Yeah. It's blank. There's no... I mean, it's not blank. Okay. It's, it's got engravings and whatnot on it. But there's no school. There's no... That one Any of that. One? Which ring? This one. Because that's the one you were showing when they said it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, exactly. Oh, that's what I mean. Is this the one they wanted or that one? I don't know. Do you guys want them both? Speculate on size. Oh, here, let me see. This one's... Maybe a seven. My ring finger is about five and a half. My pointer finger is about a six, so this would be about a seven. I think she's talking about this one. I have a ring sizer here. And all my jewelry making crap that is hidden behind. All of this stuff. And they don't know where it is. Because I could tell you the exact size of every one of these rings. In seconds. But I legit don't know where it is. Um, hold, please. They can't hear you. I have the mic. Dark's up there trying to talk to you all. Uh, Try this on. I can't. What size is it? It's probably a nine. Thanks. Nine and a half. Thanks. Yeah, <laughs> this ring is probably a nine, nine and a half. this generic school ring. They said yes to both. I made my husband put it on. <laughs> <laughs> so we would know. We know our ring sizes in this family. Um, this is a little silver solitaire with a tiny diamond chip. It's really sorry. Oh right, you can hear, sorry. Next to the heart above the bow and the rainbow ones. Fog. This is like Stripey. sewn with yarn. It's not a real ring. You, you yeah, but that was my last my last one. Look at this. Brooches next to the heart what? above the bow and the rainbow ones. Yes. <laughs> what is he doing? He's asleep. Like that. Next to the heart, next to the heart above the bow, this? The rainbow ones and the rainbow ones. 
This is what I think you mean by rainbow one. It is much brighter than this, by the way. They're all stone set rhinestones. Oh, I want Girl Scout cookies. Top row. That one. Foxy, I hate it. It's so gritty. The one next to it. I hate it. Said so the one above the rainbow. Oh, this one? I like this one. This is Trafari. It's pearls, and then there are tiny rhinestones all around the pearls. It's really pretty. Someone put Girl Scout that out. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want these two? Did I say it's Trafari? It is Trafari, isn't it? Can we read it? No. Move your hand. Uh, Foxy said I'll take that one. Yes, it's Trafari. No, just the last gem. Okay. Not this one. Got you. Okay. Excuse me, Trax. Sir Fatness. You must move. No. You must move, <laughs> chonky chonky. You must move, chonky cat. Can I also cat. see first heart with the green stone? This one? This heart, green stone. It's a heart with a bow and a little pale green stone in it. Exactly. He loves feet. This cat is he so weird. With him. He got a problem. Like, he will be so up on your feet that you might accidentally punt him down the stairs because he'll just, like, run up to your foot while you're walking down the hallway. I'll He's take a mess. that one, too. You want that one, too? I don't want it. You want it in that bag? <laughs> okay. I miss the bracelets. Anything that would fit a larger wrist. Um, I don't think so. I have a couple of bangles that adjust, but I will tell you that I have very small wrists and all these bracelets are pretty small. Yeah, we have like tiny wrists. What size is your wrist? Are your initials KM? Because this is for you. Um, I do have this bad boy right here that's memory wire. So that's going to fit. Anybody? <laughs> Don't risk it all. It looks like this. This is are me. Are the items on the upper left necklace pieces? Yes, they are. That is a gigantic stack of necklaces. So, um, Lucy, my wrist is six inches around. Right? Yes, this cat is crazy. It's a magnet. Okay, so <coughs> I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. My old man was a toe assassin. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Trax is a special cat, so there's also that. He is special. He doesn't ever look up. He always looks down. Not to be secure. He's weird. Give me the magnet already. I know. Gabby. I, Gabby wants I the can't magnet. stop. Okay, so my wrist, six inches. See, look, we have the same size wrist. It's because I made you. <laughs> okay. Like, I said. like, this bracelet is not. Much bigger than that. It's probably about six and a half, seven. Why you want this, Gabby? You had to play with it, though. You have to just, you have to do this. Where's Gabby's bed? All day long. It has to sound like this in your office all day long, okay? That's what you have to do all day. 
that fast too. Okay, just. Oh my God, I'm at work. <laughs> and the more stressed out you get, the more you gotta click it. So Take the crosses from the necklace pieces, Dash. Hello, buddy. Both of these. Uh, you can keep going for a minute, okay? I, you can you you can keep going. I will <laughs> yeah, I put this in Foxy's bag. Smacker. So for reference, okay. See this bag? That's a pound of jewelry. It's a lot. Would you like to be an 80s attorney lady? Because you. All of the crosses. You can be an 80s attorney lady. Foxy wants all of the crosses. We all have right. Jesus pins. I got you. You want Jesus pins? We got those. Um, Hang on. All the crosses. Jesus, 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 Jesus. Put them on here. Um, I don't know what. This is the Ten Commandments in another language. Maybe. I think it's the Ten Commandments because it looks like it's on stone. I don't know if this is of interest to you. <laughs> Sue myself with stuff. Hebrew. <laughs> it's in Hebrew. We do not... I'm not trying to be ignorant, but I am completely ignorant as to what that language is. I'm sorry. Um, angels? It's Hebrew. Okay. Got it. I'm sure that and Foxy's. Do you want to ask Foxy if they want these first? They want all the crosses. This is all the crosses. Do they want the Jesus stuff? Yes. Foxy. I'll take it to Macy about making a charm bracelet. Oh, that would be cute. Do you want angels? Okay, where's the charm? More than one angel. Can I see some angels? There's, um... They want to see the angels. You can see the angels. Do I only have two angels left? We had a bunch earlier, didn't we? I don't know. How much stuff I lost track. All right. Oh, here's another cross. Um, I have a little charm necklace that has a clover, a heart, and a butterfly on it. Give her that cross. This little angel, this little angel. Other angel is mine's, lol. Yes. Yeah, you got the one with the belt. You got the one with the belt. Okay, this okay. is the one with a rose. So this up here by my thumb, that is a charm necklace that opens up and you can slide the little charms on it. <laughs> right? So then we have this little angel and then we have this little Rhinestone angel. This angel has a rose. I want to go pick flowers. And she's pretty. And she's marked. If I know what, I want what? And I can't. I can't read it. Hunt, I don't understand. Uh, this little angel pin is uh, I'll pass the angel collection. crystals with pink uh, wings. That's what it looks like. Okay, no angels for you. <laughs> no angels for you. Hunt says I want the angels. Hunt, you want all the angels? You Hunt, can have all the angels. You can have all of them. Foxy, um, would you like to know what your weight is at? These are two wishbone pins that each have two wishbones in them with a blue rhinestone and a pearl. If you like voodoo. You know? Voodoo witch doctor. You into that getting bones kind of business. 
<laughs> but that should have been shown with the brooches and I hadn't shown them yet. So I wanted to show you guys that. Um, these are Hunt's angels. Hunt gets all the angels. So put these in. So Foxy said you have any flowers. I have a shit ton of flowers. All right, I'll tell you what, let's do this. Let's do this. Hop up. I have to sit down. All right. Flowers in, in what? Hunt. <laughs> what the heck? Um, there's nothing in that bag. That doesn't weigh anything. Um, okay. 3.4. Yeah, you're at three ounces, Foxy. You're not even close. Um, okay, so I have earrings, the brooches you just saw, pendants, uh, obviously a pile of necklace, um, the bracelets, earrings, and then everything else has already been put into bags. So on the table, I have a stick pin flower, right? Um, here, hold that up in the camera, would you please, without hitting it. I have this uh, necklace pendant. Move to this way. No, this way. See where it's focused on that jewelry right there? It's focused on the necklaces. There you go, now it's focused on the pendant. It's a rose, you'll take it. Okay, it's yours. Um, Cause this is a flower. Foxy saw that already. Um, there's this one. Hang on a second. There's this one. There's this one. That's a pretty one. There's this one. There's a little clover. Show Foxy those first. Stick pins as well. Take the pendant. This one? I'll take the stick pin too. This one? Those are all three pendants. So that first one uh, is back when bottom left flower, yes, others, nah, okay? This first one is back when like um, the rose gold, yellow gold, coppery looking gold was hot. This what was it unicorn. called? Black Hills Gold. Have you showed the unicorn? Yes, I showed the unicorn. There's a unicorn, everyone. There is a unicorn, yes. Um... Floral, can you grab this chonky cat? Never mind, he'll move. Your cat. Floral bracelets. Let's see if I have a floral bracelet. He ain't gonna move. I don't think I have a floral bracelet. Come here. Look how fast this cat is. <laughs> he is a chonky Yo, cat. Crap, baby boy. Um. Come here, Freddy. You go be on the chair. Stop over there. I need the unicorn too, Lucy. We have, okay, you can have the unicorn. Yeah, let's go. I have this floral pendant that is attached to. And a long gold chain. Which long gold chain? This floral pendant on a pearl necklace? So Lucy said long gold chain, Foxy said what is the pendant above slash next to the dangle? Are you talking about this flower? Chalk or not included. It does not have a pin back on it. 
it's super gritty and I don't like it. You'll take the floral and the pearl. There you go. Um, super long chain? Do you mean like this one? Like this really long chain? Tudor rose on pearl, yes. Gold pendant with the red stone. This one? No, the left pile of necklace pendants. This is for Lucy. Is that Lucy's bag? Yes. <laughs> left pile of necklaces. Are you saying that it's perfect, Lucy, to the chain? Lucy's the chain. Gold pendant, redstone for Lucy. Under the heart pendant. <laughs> Amber brown. That's a pendant. Perfect to the chain. So did Lucy not want that little one? Here you go. Wish I could do a screenshot to show you. It's okay, Foxy. Keep trying. Keep trying. Let Lucy finish first. Okay. I'll take the floral and the pearl. <clears throat> There's a dangle pendant. Looks like a flower design in a circle. Are you talking about this one that has the chains underneath it? Left. Oh, I see that one. This? I know, right? I'm so sorry, Foxy. <laughs> Don't give up on me. That's what this one looks like. By the red ruby thing. No, not that. I legit have no skull point. Hi, Brownie. Above ten o'clock in the pendant pile. Thing. Oh, this big tassel? This is the flower in the circle. No. This is the tassel. This is the flower in the circle. That's the flower in the circle? Lord love a duck. I know, right? I was using my phone to see what you guys were seeing, by the <laughs> way. That's what I pulled out. Flower. <laughs> okay. <laughs> So this is for Foxy. I literally, I literally pulled my phone out so I could look at the I 100%. Where my hand was. <laughs> I was just waiting for you to be like, nah. <laughs> I don't want that shit. <laughs> Hi, Brownie. <laughs> I know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, by the way, Foxy, if you didn't notice, I, I am dark. I'm helping today. Yes. My son is helping today. All right. Yeah, that's why I pulled my foot out because I was like, so there's a dangly thing up here by the thread thing. Oh, that's what that looks like from here. <laughs> where's, where's Waldo player? I know. I had to look through my phone. Can I have the gold amber stone, not the red one that was put in there? There you go. Oh. Let's see. There was a...
Lucy, I'll give you a free ounce if you don't make me search through this bag. No, I know where it is. It's right here. <laughs> here. Show that to Lucy so you can make sure that that's the right thing I should do. We're having fun. This is what you don't want, right? Here, I'll hold it up here. This is what you don't want, right? This is fun. <laughs> Lucy. Well, I couldn't, I couldn't look at the screen over here and then look at the table, so I looked at it on my phone to see where my hand was at. I know, right? It's been a long seven hours. <laughs> yeah, that's right. And like two Gabby, go take a break. I can do this. It's okay. If you need breaks, go take them. You don't have to be here nonstop. That's it's why really, I'm here. It's okay. I mean, I don't but have Gabby's choice. modding. I know I you. Did. Here. I know you did. <clears throat> okay. She said I already did. I mean, technically, I did have a choice. I can just go chill out in my room. She okay. Said, I drove home and I'm eating. I'm good, really. I don't want to miss the stuff. Hey. Who's who's got big wrists? <laughs> like dark. Where am I at? Um, on your second bag, eleven point two. Eleven point two. Uh, somewhat bent has two bags. Well, sort of. The multi ribbon swirls on the brooches. This is bent. Where's this one right here? Weigh this one. Yeah, Ben, you have a one pound bag and a, and then you guys, Caribbeas, uh, Caribbea ha, has a 11.5. Lucy! Look. It gets bigger. Ooh. Ooh. So I got that. Yes. Okay, just a second. I mean, she's been standing and sitting. Can't really describe them all next to the bows on the left, right? You want the junk chains? Okay, but, but I'm going to, can I put more in there? Because I'd like to fill that up. <laughs> what are they at? Hang on a second. Are you wanting me to just take it from 11.5 to, that's 10. So that would put you, that's going to, that's going to put you about six ounces. Is that right? Put you 21 and a half ounces. So what is that? Revisit the pearls. Okay. That will put you at, yes, thank you so much. I'm going to do it on this little camera right here since dark is I'm doing this for working through that for Foxy. So we have this strand with the little tassels. Take the top two. Okay. I was like, I'm just going to put them all in there. <laughs> You'll pick which one you want. We have this choker. Is this one Foxy? Yes. yes. Foxy, you're at 7.3. We have this multiple strand with you can go back to using this that bad boy right there. I can't go back to doing that anymore. Oh, okay. With the flower and wire wrap. The pearl necklace with the flower and wire wrap. We have this big chunky pearl with also, this clasp. This pearl that I have. Lucy, are you talking about the pearls that are in Dark's hands right now? Are the pearls glass or pearl pearls? I think these ones are glass. I don't think these are Um, no, I don't have. Okay. 
I don't have any glass pearls here. They are all fake pearls. And there's a pink and a That's cream. The jewelry madness. Maybe somebody snapped them up. Uh, these are the only pearls that I have left. And then there's this one right here, which is a bunch of tiny pearls sure, no, you can't play with in a pearls. chain. Like these <laughs> Jewelry madness. I can't. You guys crack me up so bad. Yeah, those are the only ones that I have left, Lucy. Unless, ouch, unless we put some, unless we put some in a bag. <clears throat> Okay. A necklace with a gold pendant with a white stone. Are you talking about this one? This you still want, oh, you do one. want that wrap bracelet? This one? That does this? Would be uncomfortable. And then there's this bangle too. The nugget pendant. And the necklace dart set. This nugget pendant in this bag. Put those back. This goes in whose bag? Lucy. This goes in Lucy's bag. And then Lucy's asking for the one with pearls. These are Lucy's bag. Bent. Someone else wanted that, you think. Can you weigh my two bags, Islua? Islua, you're at like a pound and four ounces. Uh, it's just metal, Foxy. It's not white. It's just really shiny. He said he was. Or she's they. I don't know. Oh, cat. There you go. Oh, shit, throwing one everywhere. Do you guys want anything else? Here's my hand. It's not going to, we're not putting it up right this second. We're not putting it up. I'm going to start bagging things. You it's like shiny. shiny. <laughs> I mean, this thing's pretty cool. It's got letters in it. The back of this thing. This is for somewhat bent. Even shinier. <laughs> right.
dark, the one that you put down on the left that had a stone in it. So that's your right. Maybe looked a little filigree. Can you hold that up? Oh, this the locket you just had. So this one's the locket I just had. Right, Foxy wants that, so let me have it. And then by the bracelets, more left. You put a necklace down by the bracelets. What? I mean, I put these two bracelets down. Oh, I had this one. Maybe. Let me, let me adjust it so you can actually see it. Here. Let me see it. It's hard to see over there. Here. It's very dainty. get all those tangled. It is very pretty. It's very dainty. All right, so my plan, half a pound on the junk change stuff you probably don't want. Deconstruct what we can use and share on the rest. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that works. Emerald green gem over in the necklace pendants. Oh, I see it. In the necklace pendants. Yes, it's a necklace. Um, all right. Bent, do you think that you've about got everything that you want? You do not have to stop. What we're going to do next is I am going to sit here and put these into the bags for the Etsy listings. And at any time that I'm doing that, if you guys see something that you want, I'll pull it right out and put it in your bag. So that's not a problem. Unless you find acorns. So but if somebody know. is... Foxy says they'll take that. <laughs> if somebody is done and wants me to put their listing up on Etsy for them... then I can do that too. No, there's no acorns. If there was, we'd have found them already. I mean, there was the one that looked like a pine cone that Gabby took. But there's not. Would yours be light enough for one bag? Hang on just a second, Eslua. Yeah, Islua, you're fine, and your Etsy listing for one bag is already up there. Here, I'll take that one, too. So you have that and then the two soaps, Islua? There's also this one, probably, <laughs> but I don't know if that's, like, your style. Um, one. somewhat bent. Okay. So, Bent, you it have, had the double soap. are you guys, Bent, are you guys buying these separate? Are you buying them together? Did 
together is fine. Then we're going to call it an even two with all the chains. How about that? Does that work? Okay. Okay. So I want just a second, guys. I don't want to lose track. Of who is who here, okay? Cross goes blue if it's the one I'm pointing at. I don't know if they can hear me. Talk louder, they can hear you. Yeah, and you don't have to wrap up now if you don't want to. Okay? 100%. Because I'm going to keep going and bag all these up. Foxy, you're at 10 ounces. You have six more ounces. This one's very small. This blue, and there's also this teeny tiny blue one. That's white, a really pretty dark blue. You had more than two soaps this little? Okay. Well, you know what you have. Did I miss anything from anybody just now? What is this for? Is Lua? Yeah. Why are you pointing over there? Is Lua's back over here? Whatever. Okay. Purple, purple. Um, Bent, you are. You're on the listing. If you want to do more, you 100% can. Um. But you're up there. This is the listing. You're going to look for your name. Your name on Twitch, obviously. Um, and you're going to choose that variation with your name. And then that will be yours. So, I have somewhat bent. I have Lucy. Lucy, I have you with two bags, which is accurate. I'm going to put Foxy in here. You're in there. No, you're fine, it's Lua. Are you showing that to Caribia? Yeah. Okay. I'm trying to figure out which one they're talking about. Because this one has a sickle, small stones. silver rainbow small stones on the edge. There's two of them. I grabbed the other one first. I already grabbed that one that was on the edge right there. Look out, baby. Look out, Shira. So the one in the box or the one on the edge? So I have Lucy. I have Bent. I have Foxy, I have Gabby, it's Lua, this one doesn't have jewels, and this one just has these three, and then this one has these 
This has got two rows. There we go. Above the big honking ring. Best description of the night right there. Are you sure you want to come say hi, everybody? You want to come say hi? Say hi, everybody. No, she said. You can look at my butt. No, put your hand on the table. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so I'm at the egg ring. That's you, you're so nice. You let me pet you. Up one. Right one. Yes. Tarnished adjustable silver ring with, go to your right dark so that it's there you go you're zoomed in you want that one it's got a diamond chip in the center of uh silver i'm trying y'all there's a lot of jewelry on it you're fine everybody's doing a good job <laughs> We're doing a good job, guys, navigating this. Thank you so much for being patient and understanding. Your cat just farted on me. So gross. She keeps eating your cat's cat food. It's not good for her. Right? We're doing a good job. Okay, so. Um, let me tell you what the listing looks like right this second. If you guys want to change it, you tell me, I'll change it. This isn't permanent. Right now I have Gabby at three bags, Islua at one bag, Lucy Lou at two bags, Somewhat Bent at two bags, and Foxy at one bag. Also has the soap, the Purple orange. pendants for Foxy. Purple stones in the pendant area. So this one's like a light pink purple. This that one, yeah. A purple surrounded by white. And this one right here. That one's not purple. It's a red. Oh. It's like a ruby. I thought it was purple. No. If you turn it, you can see. This one has purple in it too. It's multicolored, but these two. We also have these. Are you focused? No. You can't see them. I'll take those two. Foxy says I'll take those two. This one's lighter. The second one's lighter. It's like Alexanderite. Yeah, so it's like a really light lavender. Um, hold the sh here. Um, rhinestones got like infinity, larger stone bottom, smaller stone top. It's a necklace of matching earrings. Can you see that? Not really. Matching earrings and necklace. Yeah, these are like what you get at Cole's Christmas for 10 bucks. That's what I said. I'll take that set. Are you talking about the one? You want both of them? The two with the other, the purple. It's, yeah, it's in the same box. Mom, hmm? The two was to the purple. Right, I put those in there already. It says I'll take that set. 
right? The first set, Foxy? To the second set. Do you want the set in the, in the silver box too? Yeah, it's in your bag. I got it. Okay. So the one in the black box. Okay. So what you guys can see the top of this giant stack here, these are all earrings. You'll pass on the second. I put it back. So we're good. We're on the same page. <laughs> all right. You do me a favor and watch chat. I'm going to clean my glasses because they're a freaking mess. I have to charge my phone chat, so I'm not going to have one. Well, that's okay. You can sit here and watch it on my yeah. monitor. All right. So here's how bagging this up is going to go, right? I'm going to start to put stuff in a bag. And if at any point one of you wants something that I'm putting into a bag, you tell me and I will take it right out and put it in your bag. Okay. This is not a problem. Leave her alone. So, we're going to start by doing... White wires, where am I? Huh? Eleven point nine, but that's also counting that black box. We're going to do those two rings. We're going to do this little gemstone bracelet and this sand dollar bracelet. Oh. Those are going to go in this bag. We're going to do this engraved deer pin. This ZD heart, this heart for pendants. We're going to do this colored rhinestone and one of the bows. Foxy said, so for the rest of mine, surprise me until you get to a pound. Okay. Foxy, do you want um, pierced earrings? Do you want clip on earrings? We're going to put this necklace in here, and we're going to put this big chonky necklace in here. <laughs> Either. We're going to lose some 80s earrings in this bag right here. Um, but we're going to mix it up. We're going to put the sad plastic flowers in there. And these weird leopard guys. Um, I think I'm going to put this heart in there, too, because it matches that other one. Some big colored pearls. Flowers, bottom row, third from left. Seriously. Why does it smell like a cat has pooped in here? Because Skull has been farting and so has Ishidra. Because both of them went downstairs and ate that new cat food. Well, get them the hell out of here. This is disgusting. Seriously, it smells like somebody has pooped in this room. Did you poop in this room? 
Why you stink so bad? Jesus, a shira. How can you even sit under there? God. I told you that cat food is not good. Oh for my her. gosh. <laughs> Flowers, me. bottom row, third from left. Lord love a duck. They are uh, clip on dogwoods. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> sure Turn on the fan. These animals are disgusting. Did you hear her? She's like, I didn't do she it. She doesn't care. Come here, old lady cat. Stop eating beta's food. I am telling you right now. No, they ate the wrong food because they're bad. So Ashira can't have meow mix, <laughs> and that's what beta attracts me. Here, you want to see them up close? You want these? And she went downstairs and ate their food because I didn't know that tracks poop next to her food bowl. They don't need to know every little thing. Well, Nobody wants to know this horrible story. This is for Miss Maybe, and I did not bag it and mark it, so I'm going to do that real quick. Because I want to make sure that I put that tie clip in with her surprise that we're sending her. You needed to know about that. You had a cat who's allergic to fish. Oh my goodness. But she was 11. She's um, not changing 11 year old cat's food. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to pull some earrings out of this box. You know how hard it is to get no fish in cat's food. <laughs> yes. We're going to put these in here. The screw backs. Gold. Plain gold, gold and a couple of hoops in different sizes, I think, would be nice. They said need different food. More like she needs to not eat that food. Right? Well, the boys do good. That they do. Over there. That's fine. <laughs> <coughs> Here, weigh this. Oh my gosh. Huh? Is that one one point perfect. Three, four. Perfect. Let it stop it. Stop weighing it. It's perfect. It's found. It's perfect. You want another one? Or you no, I have a full one here. I'm just not drinking enough of it. Drink water. What should we name this one? Hmm? What should we name that bag? Gold digger. <laughs> Gold digger. <laughs> Bling. All right. This next one. Okay, so we want a bling bag. We can do a bling bag. Let's do a bling one. Bling, bling. So we'll take the I'm watching you bracelet, the I can poke your eye out ring. Because <laughs> <laughs> you need to defend yourself. Um, big gold bracelet. Looks kind of like a watch band. We'll pop that in there too. Ooh, put this in there. Uh, ring with diamonds. Put this in there. Uh, hang on a second. I'll get there. I got to get the bracelets in the. Uh, who asked me about this Emmons belt earlier? We're going to do the rhinestones and the wishbone, wishbones, rhinestone pins. We'll do this big amber chain right here. All my days it's 3 a.m. in the morning and you're still on. Yes. What's that amber looking I bracelet? I am. Amber looking bracelet. Cat 
Can I see, uh, it's Lua, can I see the filigree looking earrings below the red button? Yes. This is uh, some kind of plastic. It's not amber. It's, um, it looks like butterscotch. Looks like candy. I don't know. I am Mrs. Addict. Can you see it? Uh, can I see the I'm looking at you bracelet you put in the bag? Yes, you can. Have a friend. That was crazy. I'm a little tired, guys. You gotta ask me shit five or six times. See this? Looking at you. This is me. I like Looking at you. Misses. <laughs> <laughs> the women's little straight up said, ah, it's J just Gabby, lol, but no, I woke up to go to the Wii and hers and dark faces are still on the screen. It I focused like right before I move. Asshole. There we go. See that? Watching you. Hi, I'm Oscar the Grouch <laughs> in a bracelet. <laughs> uh, who else asked for something? Uh, it was above that. Can I see the filigree looking earrings below? The underside. Phone? Yes, you can. But hang on. Yes. It's got a security yes. chain on it. I got to unhook it and stuff. Looks like that. Is it focused? Till when the box is open again. If Lou, I'll grab it. You want that? This one goes in this box, right? Okay, then I'm going to throw this bracelet into this bag. Very mod. Rhinestones. That's going in the bag. Lemon went back to sleep watching us. All right. Have a good one, Lemons. It's Lua. You want to see earrings out of this box? Who asked about the belt? Who asked about the belt? You said something about buy the red ones, but I cannot recall what all you said, Is Lua. I think it was you. Filigree ones below the red button ones. They're clip-ons. Are these the ones that you want? Is that the ones you wanted? Two necklaces no, with the circle the pendants. Can I see them? One looks buried and the other is open. Yes, I'll take these. Put Put these in Islua. Yeah, and then Foxy with the one in the This pendant is a flat pendant. This pendant opens. And is a perfume pendant. So this part is, you know, like open weave so that the perfume smell, because you put perfume here, comes out. I'm waiting for the type. Are these the two that you wanted to see? I assume that that's what you meant. But I could be wrong. but I'll pass. Okay. Um, that Emmons belt. Somebody asked about that Emmons belt, and I'll tell you right now, I'm not going to put it in a bag. 
but I will list it, list it separately for 10. I don't want it to, if I put that in a bag, it'll seriously get damaged. So I'm just, I'll list it separately for 10 by itself. So if somebody wants to buy that Emmons belt that Dark is wearing, which they can't even see you. I you think can't you can't, it. that's what I'm saying, take it off. Um, oh, then it's just going to go up for 10. I'm going to put this copper bow tie in here. It's copper and pearl. It's got a copper box chain. I'm going to put it in the bag. We're going to put this uh, plastic and gold beaded necklace in here. Huh? Says Lewis said your hand keeps being too low for the camera. I'm sorry. Uh, necklaces, are there any butterflies or hearts for foxes? I'm trying to get this. Is that zoomed in? This is an orchid. Foxy had asked for flowers. And this is the type of necklace that moves along the chain. Look so you can adjust the length of it that way. Okay. Right? There's hearts. Stop, they're going to get tangled. There's this rhinestone heart. You want the orchid? You can put that in the bag. This one? Yeah, put that in this bag. <laughs> Pass on the heart. This is Foxy. Yeah, my shoulders are like killing me, okay? So if you like, I know, if you can't see something or it's not focused or, and you want me to reshow it, just tell me, guys, because I'll do it. I can do it too. But I'm struggling a little bit. I will admit that. All right, I need seven more ounces. And we're going to start with the 80s power earrings. Did you already put the chains on? Oh, this is called bling. You know what? The set's going in here. I'll take out something if I have to. This is a set. Giant bangle bracelet. Matching earrings. This should probably go in there. This Pendant. One. Nah. And hoops. Are there, right? That's going in here. Uh, are there any other dewdrop necklaces? <laughs> we need five ounces. I don't know what a dewdrop necklace is. The shape of like a raindrop. Like a teardrop? Yeah, like this. I'm going to tell you, nobody has bought these. These are screwbacks. They're little re red leaves with green rhinestones. Was it, um... Highly recommend. To ask for the chains? These are old. I've already got them all packed. That's These are done. Two chains. I know. That's done. You want them, Gabby? They're so pretty. Excellent. This is our bling bag. Bling bag. Done. Mm. 
the wrong color, right? I can understand that. They're a nice find. For somebody, um, Reese. Foxy, dark is starting to show you something. It looks like a flower. I can't see the screen. It looks like a little flower with a little, almost like a, what are they called? It's a lily of the valley with yeah. a pearl in it. You want this? Foxy wants this. I just found it. I knew Foxy was looking for flowers. This is Foxy's. Gabby, I have anything nice that's blue to give Peps as something blue for her wedding? A lot of the blue stuff has already gotten taken. Uh, we do have blue earrings. I know. Where's the... Those are too big. Nothing. Put that on the floor that's empty. Thank God. Something's empty. Thank God. Hey, no, this isn't empty. What? What's in it? There's a small diamond painted. Okay. Damn it. Orchids for Foxy. Show her those, please. Oh. I think they're gone. The piece I'm looking for, lemons, I think it's gone. These are earrings, Foxy. They're orchids with a little pearl. Oh, no, no, the, these. Lemons. They're blue with purple stones and pearls. What do you think? For Pevs, I bet she already has her earrings. I bet she's already oh, got her. Really pretty though for a I bet she's got her jewelry figured out though. You know what I mean? Because I don't know what her dress looks like and stuff. I bet she's got her jewelry figured out. I do think they look like Pevs, but I bet she wouldn't wear them for her wedding. Um, okay, what's our next bag? What do we name in our next bag? A pin she could attach? Yeah, there's no pins. Are you calling me? Yeah. What's up? You want to stretch? Okay. I know. I do. There's that there's this this is all that there is. It's a mess. Um Yeah. Give me just a minute, guys. I'll be right back. You want to pack a bag? Name the bag and then pack appropriate things into it. Two rings, 
two bracelets, two pins, two pendants, at least two necklaces, and then earrings that vary from like 40s to 2000s, right? I'm trying to put different years in there so that the bags are like pretty cool. Foxy, did you see the floral soap that I hand painted? It's a pretty little pearl. That's what I have so far. These are both Foxy's. So you have two pendants and two bracelets? Mm -hmm. There's a necklace. There's some pearls. All the pearls. Everybody said no to these so they can just go in the bag. Because everybody's seen these already. Gosh, that's stiff. Well, this is probably not gonna, hang on a second. I need a freezer bag. I need a bigger bag. Do the bow with the pearls in that bag. Foxy said no. Foxy said no, you haven't seen the flower soap? Oh my God, Foxy. Okay, so I show, show her the, um, well these are too big. You can show, well, yeah, show her those. The bow with the pearls. And this pearl choker. Should fit. You, you missed the dice? I'll show you those too. So I hand painted it. Move it just a little bit like shift so that the wrap, yeah, there we go. Yeah, so I hand painted that soap with mica and then show them the inside of the soap. It smells like floral bouquet. It's in the limited edition soaps. It's goat's milk and glycerin, which is what all my soap is. But 
these are the four that you can still buy. And they all go together. Yeah. So if you want a bar, you can pick your particular bar. What are we calling this one? Painted four. Pretty with pearls. Oh, I thought you meant the bar. I don't know. Spring flower. It's called 3D Floral on the Limited Edition Soaps. So I mix goat's milk and glycerin. I only use cosmetic grade micas. And um, garden show, right? Um, No, nope, that's not what I wanted to do. It's called Floral 3D. This is the one if you bought, but that's the whole pot of blood. And that's the listing for the limited edition soaps. We do it every Thursday. That's why they tease me about having a soap cult. Right? Yep, that's the Slewis butterfly. Um, I also have that 3D soap in uh, orange cream sickle. It smells so good. Uh, it's not hand painted though. It's just an orange and cream, super swirly. But it still looks really cool. Show them the back of it. So all of our soaps um, come with something special in it because our community makes them, right? So I physically make the soap, obviously. Um, but everybody puts ideas in the ideas channel about scents and all that kind That's of stuff the that they want. And then um, I make those. So orange creamsicle was one of those. The 3D mold was a surprise for people. <coughs> um, yes. I think there's, how many are there left? I think there's five. So there's four. There's five of the cream sickle. And there's five of the corn cream. Yeah. Yep, there's loofah soaps too. Um, anyway, in the, our regular line of soaps and in the limited edition um, square soaps from that link, um, behind the label is a, Quote from the cult, right? For instance, where's one that's... Here's one from Lemons. You want to see a quote from Lemons? So in every bar of soap... Oh, you can't see it like that because I don't have the camera where it's always at. In every bar of soap, there's a little folded up quote. Camera, please focus. I'm so tired. You can just read it. It says, quotes from the cult. I need moral support here. My nose is twitching. Life gives you lemons. And what I do is I go through the... Uh, I go through the Discord, I go through my VODs. That's the resin soap dish we just made. Uh, and I collect all of the quotes from everybody talking about soap. Um, so the whole community is represented in the soap and you never know what quote you're gonna get in what bar. But you guys are, you guys are all in there. The dice are not, I haven't trimmed them up and clean them up yet. I did not enjoy making dice. You like pulling the dice out. I did like demolding them, but I did not like making them. They were so difficult. But we're going to we're going to explore that. Right. We're going to we're going to work on it. I have a bigger mold where I can put a die inside of a bigger mold of dice. And um, I can make a soap sample. Actually, yes, they did come out good. 
I've got a couple of bubbles in one. I've got a couple of... You have one that the corner's taken off of. Which we'll right, it's got a bubble in the corner, which they're not perfect. But for my first go, I, I learned a lot. I'd never poured resin before, and they're difficult. So I thought they turned out good. And then we did an over pour and made some wings and little cogs and stuff like that, and they turned out really good too. Yeah. But, um, so Thursdays we do bath and body, right? So that's soap, bath salts, lip balm, lotion, bath bombs, whatever we're making. But it's always soap. Um, what do we name in this bag? What's our next bag going to be named? We could do chains. You want to do chains? We could do all these black chains. Bath and body. Leather hearts. It smells like leather. It's so good. It's so pretty it too. Actually does smell like if you get like knockoff leather shoes. It does. It smells it like. It straight up smelled like I had brand new shoes and I walked upstairs and grabbed them, and the the soap smells like just like. Chained my melody. I love it. Chained melody. Yes. It doesn't smell like real leather though. It smells off like knockoff leather. It smells good though. Yeah. Chain. I need to find earrings with chains. So floral 3D, do they have um, a specific scent? So floral 3D smells like um, it's spring bouquet. So one of them smells like flowers, and the orange one smells like orange creamsicle. There's two 3D flower ones. I'm telling you the leather hearts. If you guys want to pick a bar, tell me what one you're looking at, and then you can pick out your specific bar, and I'll put it with your stuff. So, Bone, uh, bone Daddy, what scent is that? Bone Daddy is fresh cut grass. It looks like there is dirt with grass on top. And there is a bone embed in it. It has a little white goat's milk bone. Um, but fresh cut grass smells like you just walked into a meadow. So this like is the bone dead one. That's the bone. First day of spring, right? Everything just like it just rained. The grass is wet. They do. Right? Smells like first day of spring. I named it Bone Daddy after Jack Skeleton. Skellington from Nightmare Before Christmas. If you like cool soap, Foxy, this is literally a cup of iced tea of Ice, pink lemonade. Pink lemonade. With a lemon wedge. Yes, you get a free lemon. You get a free lemon wedge with your pink lemonade cup soap. <laughs> but yeah, you can pick out your bar so that you make sure that you get one that you like. Ah. Um, flower, these are, these are really unique, okay? So these are flower earrings. Tell me if I'm, I'm doing this with the wrong hand so I can't see this, can't see my monitor. Gold floral earrings, pearls in the center. There you go. These have really unique backs. They're clip backs, but they have a screw back attached and they are marked but they're different 
I know you were looking for flowers, Foxy. I don't know if you want those or not. Oh, the other thing you're also able to do, Foxy, if you come in on Thursdays, is you can start a box and put back soap and stuff that you want. These little floral earrings, you want to see them again? I can't do it with my right hand anymore. You want to tell Foxy about the little layaway you have? I don't have a layaway program. Your little That's not what that is. No, it's not. Um, your stashes, your yeah, if you want to pick out your bars, I'll set them aside with your name on it so that when you buy them from the Etsy store, you get the exact bar that you picked out. You want those? I was just trying to remember that you were looking for flowers and, and that kind of stuff before I put stuff into these bags that you maybe would want or somebody else might want. Perfect. And Benton said we're naming this one Chained Melody. Bling, pretty and pearls. Dress up your boy. These are peoples. Okay, so the loose stones. I still don't know what to do with those. I don't want to keep them. I don't know how much to charge for them. I don't know what to do with them. <laughs> Do you guys know what I'm talking about with the loose stones? See all these? These are from Linderford's Fine Jewelers. There's 35 carats here. All certificate. They're CZ Lab created. I've got, um, Okay, I'm going to try and remember off the top of my head, and it was eight hours ago that I did this. So if I get this, if I'm not exactly right on my numbers, I apologize, okay? I want to say I have three carats of sapphire. I have four carats of onyx. I have three or four carats of ruby, and everything else is clear CZ in one and two carat rounds. These normally go for 10 to $20. Ruby is like sell them separately. Right? Sell them separately? Well, I don't want to put them in a bag, right? But I would like to sell the whole bunch of them together. So what should that price be? Because you've probably got, I counted them all up before. 35 carats, dark, what was it? I don't know. Oh, there's another sapphire. We didn't count that one. Yeah, so it's um, round, brilliant, 58 facets. High quality, internally flawless, color grade excellent, two carat, eight That's millimeters. Lab They're all lab, I believe. Every stone. Absolutely, unless you're buying antique, they just about are. Thirty-five carats, Gabby. I think it's. I think we're close. Somewhere between thirty-five and thirty-seven. Let's just say. Because I just found another sapphire in there. Let's just say you have 35 at $20 a stone. That's They're all lab. Still. Because those <coughs> are also all certified. You so. I don't want to take them into a jeweler. Why not? Because I don't want to. Linda Wall Laboratory. Um. Bear the certificate, quality batch. 
This is talking about the mountings, and this is a color analysis report. AA 92.3 flawless by grade, 99.3 by color, excellent. Certificate of Authenticity. This one? And then. Is this all they talk about? Break it into three or four lots. Trade at double cost. Or this one. Receipts that might add weight to your sale. Manufacturing jeweler, someone like me, isn't going to buy 35C at a pop. Well, I don't know. I mean, they're all one and two carat, right? Sorry, Foxy was wanting to open it. Like, that's a two carat. And there's your, your whole thing that gives you ownership of it, right? So there's several two carats in there in the CZ. And then your rubies and your sapphires, I believe, are all one. There's one smaller um, marquee sapphire. Well, you make a ring with one. Yeah. And uh, Gabby said someone said to her to make a crown. Yes, they did. Most of them are one carat. Can you look at a sapphire, please? This is a sapphire. Do you want me to take it out? Do I have one with a white back? Here's one with a white back. We might be able to see that better. They're, they're, they're freaking perfect. You can take them to a custom drawer to have something made. Yes, you can. These receipts give you 50% off to do that through Linda Wall Jewelers. What do we think price? So if they're 10, 10 to 20 a piece is average that I've seen. If you look them up on eBay right now, that's what you're going to find. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. I have twenty-four stones in here. Right? So if I put them at ten a piece, that's two hundred and forty dollars. But I'm tempted to list the whole lot at less than that. Like half. So you think I should break them up into pieces? Or just list the whole thing for 125? Because then if somebody wanted to sell, I mean, if you sold half of them, you'd make your money back, and then you've got, you know, 17, 18 carats that are free. Just list the whole thing at, like, 125. I mean, I think that's more than fair, right? Or break it into two lots. Two sets of 12 lists between 75 to 100. If you split it into two at 75, that's 150 in total. I could do that and then put the, I could make one of them all of the. What ones does lemons want? CZs. Lemons, what do you want? Do you want a one carat? You want a two carat? CZ, what do you Buy want? One off of me, please. She wants one. <laughs> I know. I don't want to sell them individually, but I'll set one back for you, Lemons. So I could do it where, like, one lot has the sapphires, the rubies, and the onyx, and some CZ, and then the other one is all CZ. Just whatever, just make it look nice for me. Right? I that, could do that. What was that two carat one you had? They're, they're all exactly the same. They're perfect. 
No, you had a two carrot. Only one small spoon. I have about six or eight. Just pick one out and use one. Okay, then I'm going to put those up tomorrow. I'll do it in two lots. I'll do it in two lots and I'll get those up in the morning. Thank you for helping me make that decision. I appreciate you guys. <laughs> All right, what are we naming our next bag? You don't know if they could even use it? Well, hopefully. I mean, the whole point of this is that I, I would like to, um, I mean, I don't want to like, you know, rip off myself because there's obvious value to this stuff. I don't want to rip off anybody else either. But if somebody's reselling, what about that one, then, you know, I'm happy to, to give them a price that is decent enough that they can resell something and make their money back. Because that's what I'm looking for when I buy stuff like this, right? So I'd like to be able to give that to other people. I think that's a decent price, yeah. Do you want a two carat for mini? That's gigantic. I mean, there's also that one. Okay. Okay, lemons. It's her 11th birthday. Uh. Okay, you see my rings that are full of paint, right? That's five blue whites. Each of those is a carrot, but they're much deeper. These are thin stones, meaning they're, they're narrower from top to point, so they're wider at the top, okay? So this is a single carat. That's a single carat on my ring. You see how much bigger that is? So if you give her a two carat for a ring, what about that one? it's gigantic. Like you'd want to, no, not that. Here. I feel like, like you'd almost be better. Diamond for your 11th birthday. I'm saying, right? You'd be better to give her a, uh, and channel set, right? Exactly. Uh, you'd be better to give her a one carat in these because they do look so large. Isn't that what you gave us for our 16th birthday with the one carat necklaces? Yes, I did. <laughs> yes, they got a one carat necklace. That was that was real diamond, not loud break, right? I still have it. I don't know if I have it still. Yes, they're real diamond. I bought each of my kids a single diamond in their lifetimes. We don't have a ton of money. All right. If you were gonna use the two carat, I would really recommend it making it a pendant or a necklace. I mean, unless you're putting it into a wedding set, right? Because that's a big ass ring, particularly for a little girl. Uh, what are we naming our next bag? One carat's fine? Okay. I'm glad you're fine with that, Lemons, because I already put it in your box. I made an executive decision. <laughs> Gold. Strings of gold, got it. This is empty. We have something empty. Strings of gold. We're gonna put these bracelets in there. Foxy, did you want any these of rings in there. Put these little pendants in here. This chain in there, this chain in there. This chain in there, this chain in there. This blingy bitch. This blingy bitch. Oh, you're good, Foxy. I didn't know if you, you picked anything out or not. I was okay, so anybody interested in gold hoops? Gold, gold hoops. Does somebody need to see these gold hoops before I start throwing these gold hoops in here? Use them all gold hoops. 
No, 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 hang on. We haven't. I'm, wait, wait. I'm going to clear out a box at a time. I'm a little overwhelmed right now. I'm just going to give you all the gold hoops. Today. I don't want all the gold hoops either. Gabby, that's a damn lie. What Gabby said? The soaps aren't going anywhere. <laughs> that is a damn lie. Okay? That is a damn lie. I mean, good night. It was so good to talk to you. Thank you so much for hanging out with us tonight. Limited edition soap is limited edition soap. It is. Foxy, I cannot tell you how many times we have sold out of soap. As an example, there is one brownie bar. The or last the person that gets the brownie bar the, gets it. The raspberry soap. Let's all go back to that. And then there will be no more brownie bars ever. You are not pressured to buy soap. Can I see the purple earrings? Um, and I do make new soap all the time, every week. So you've always got a chance to buy soap. These are plastic, by the way, not metal. They're very light. Soap does not be going anywhere. No, there's always new soap. Like, these weigh nothing. As a matter of fact, I think they might have been buttons. And somebody made them into earrings. You can like them, though. It's OK. These, however, they remind me of something from Aladdin. That's what they do. They do. The These are little clip-ons. They have uh, green, red, blue, and white rhinestones in them. I'm picketing with a bat in the trunk. And they're <laughs> <laughs> really <laughs> living. <laughs> Yes, that came from story time. I'll be right there with you, Lemon. <laughs> Put that, weigh that for you me. You all can pick up your own MP. Right. We'll get you a boy. <laughs> a boy with a bear? We will. How much is it? 8.7. All right, I'm half. Excellent. We're halfway there on this one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. It looks like they look like very saggy boobs. <laughs> look, look. <laughs> Do you have saggy boobs? <laughs> you have saggy boobs? Lemons, all you need is a bat and go onto a military installation. You'll get somebody. <laughs> The whole cucumber in the bath, can I see boobs, puts me off. <laughs> Lemons? <laughs> <laughs> Lemons, honey, are you okay? Well, to be fair, it's like 4 a.m. there. I don't know what you're saying, <laughs> Lemons. The whole cucumber in the bath. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I don't... I don't know if I, I want to... I, want, I don't want to know. I do know that I do not want to know this. Swipe right. Oh, that guy. <laughs> I know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I remember that guy. <laughs> that weird person from day one. <laughs> <coughs> you got to fill everybody else in. Oh, well, Lemons will have to tell. Lemons will have to tell the story. Like Okay, I need to move these up here so that I have a little bit of room. Can I see the pink stone pendant, Foxy? Pink stone. This one? These one? These one? Yes. Look at that. 
Do you see that? You asked me to see something, and I reached over, and I just grabbed it, and we didn't have to play Where's Waldo or anything. This is very cute, by the way, Foxy. Up, right, left, down. Right? Look how good we're getting. I mean, how many pink things are left on the table? There's a lot less on the table than there was before. I know. Shush. You just let me take my victories. Put that in Foxy's bag. Foxy, you're still not so calm, by the way. Well, the mess is getting more organized. These guys. We're going to put these red plastic guys in here. What bag are these going to go in? Here, weigh this. I don't know. Give me a second. I know, right? We're getting there. 14.2. 14.2. Excellent. You know what this bag needs? 80 zeroing. 80 earrings and this chain and also this one which could be 18 karat gold that should be one pound what are we calling this 1.7 do I have any plain necklaces what did we say who named this Foxy you named this what do we call this one is Golden that one chain Chains of gold, golden chains, mm -hmm. chains of gold. More like rainbow monstrosity. Strings of gold. This there we go. Like rainbow monstrosity to me. Gold chains. <laughs> Where's my scissors? Strings of gold. Chains of gold. Whatever. All right. Look at this chub chub boy. I need another bag. Chub chub boy, chub chub boy. Chubby 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 boy. These are. I can't remember. <laughs> These are little brown flowers. You guys want to see tracks? These are little pink pansies. And They're cute. Here looking my foot like a freak. The art of gold should be the next bag. The art of gold. Got it. You should just write it down now. Got it. Uh, we have some little red hearts in here. Do one called all ears that's almost entirely earrings. We can do that. We're going to get there. I promise you. Soon. Foxy, what are you asking me about plain necklaces? Do you mean chain? Anybody want a scarf clip? I have one scarf clip. Chains. So I have this giganto serpentine. I have this other, even heavier uh, S-curve serpentine. I have a round serpentine with a pointy pearl on it. I have this incredible, so cool, chain right here. I love this one. It's very big. This is a round weave. Um, that's got the heart on it. This is a very small one, like for a kid. Very small. Mm -hmm. Like, very small. I'm not certain. Don't put it on your neck. I'm sure it will fit you. Don't put it on your neck. 
Um, all the other chains have something attached to them. I have this big honking guy, also very pretty. The thin one you'll take. The little one? Don't bring it down here. I just, I'm not going to even show it, but I wanted to see how big it was. Okay. I know the measurement of this. The little thin one? Child size, yes. Okay. Yes, this is smaller than 12 inches. I also have this necklace. Oh, I see what you're doing. Now I know why the camera fell. Yes. Um, Which is very pretty. I just got to ask why like and what you're still doing all. It goes in Foxy's bag, please. Did you hear me? Yeah. Yeah. You're still going to go? Yeah, there's a lot. I'm, I'm going to finish. We're almost done. Okay. I'm almost done. Okay. It doesn't look like I'm almost done, but just, I am almost mm -hmm. done. Okay. Art of gold. Okay, so we're going to do some color. Um, we're going to do these little red four-point flower with pearl ones. Oh, Foxy, that necklace is probably about ten and a half, eleven inches in these? circumference. These? Zoom. Zoom. Excellent. Excellent. This is what we're going with for the rest of the night. Those are going in here. We're going to put these little green swirly dudes in here. Do you want these other ones that were really pretty? We're going to put these peach western looking things in here. Watch chat for me, Dart. Same. What? No. Green and gold earrings. Can I see, please? The green and gold ones I just put in there, in the bag. Or are they talking about these ones? No, the ones in the box. So. They're pierced, faceted green stone. Focus. Put it in front of that camera right there. I can't hold my arms up like this anymore. Okay. These little checkerboard guys. You're at fourteen point six, Foxy. We have some little red metal puffed hearts here that are pierced. Six is a pound, by the way. What's in here? These are some nice hoops. Black and gold chevrons. Little basket weaves. Little red crowns, which are a uh, freaking adorable. Hmm. What is no, I'm clearing out things one at a time. Like I legit want to get these boxes cleaned out. Giganto oh, pearls. So you like the purple stuff, right? Gold roses. There's gold roses. Pearls. Um, pearl and rhinestone hearts. Take the purple. 
And then we have a three-piece set, earrings and a brooch. Why? Why won't you focus? Oh, Gabby wants the red crowns. Too, LOL. There's Gabby, right? I mean, to be fair, camera did almost die today. <sighs> this box is empty. Did you want the roses, Foxy? These are those purple plastic things. These are... Ooh, these are pretty. These are the black ones with the hand-painted roses on them. These are hooks. Gabby said, and them red hearts too, please, and then I'm done, promise. And then you're done. You don't have to be done, Gabby. Uh, Pop those in Gabby's. These are the hand-painted flowers. It's not going to do it on that, Mom. What? It's got too much of glue over here. No, you got to put it right we got to get in the window. Mm, maybe not. That's what I was saying. They're hand-painted roses. All right. That all passed with some rolling. There you go. They're so pretty. I'll take them. <laughs> This is all like gold. Did you see the little hearts? Chain the guys. The oh shit. I dropped one. This heart. I'll like put this in here. this in here. Where are we at? Thirteen point one. Thirteen point one. Oh, these are the these <laughs> look like Ann Klein. Black daisies. <laughs> Foxy said, I'm now hearing the little mermaid in my head. Look at this stuff. Right? <laughs> Would you say my collection's complete? <laughs> <laughs> Start the pearl with rhinestones, I'll take. There's also these little daisies. They're little black daisies. They look like Anne Klein. They're not marked, so they're probably not. Three ounces. You wanna pop those in? Huh? You wanna put these in here? Art of gold. Can't tell me those don't look like art of gold. Fine. That works. I'll pass on the black. Alright, what are we naming our next bag? Somebody said the ear thing. Yeah, what was the ear thing? Uh just no don't you're, you're it's been a minute we're not gonna see it it's okay oh I missed a whisper <laughs> in my mouse all ears I do. Okay. I got you, Whisper. 
all ears, almost entirely earrings. All right, we're going to get there in a second. I can't do that one yet because I still have this crap on my table. And until this is gone. I mean, to be fair, how, if you put all the earrings in a bag, how much does that weigh? Um, a couple of pounds. We're going to get to the point where that's all I have left. Okay. Right? Like, soon. Did I put necklaces in here? Yes. I did. My dog is ready for bed. Everybody's ready for bed. It's almost midnight. I'm exhausted. I'm going to clear out this whole bin. Uh, Lucy said, ooh, those flower earrings are pretty. The pansies? Lucy, do you want those flower earrings put in your bag? These little pansies? They're super cute. I think that's what they are. Yes. <clears throat> I like these. I think these are freaking cool. They're blue with three little rhinestones. They're dangles. I think they're really pretty. Uh, I have another set of teardrop Foxy said those are cool. pearls with rhinestones Can around I them. The blue yep, they're right there. These are, this one's marked. Trafari, is it, does it say Trafari? I can't see. My eyes are exhausted. Foxy well, said clip on pearl rhinestones, question mark. I'll take them. They're marked Ronin. That's one you don't have up there. There you go. By the way. Okay. It's okay, though. That's the only pair I've seen with that brand. Little pearl flowers, big honking ear. No, <laughs> no, this can't be my longest string. No, I'm not even at nine hours yet. Okay. I stream for uh, what did we stream for my birthday? My first stream on Twitch, ten and a half hours straight where I did nothing but introduce everybody and told them how I saw them I and how I You're felt about them. Yeah, I'm almost at nine. I'm getting close. I do not normally stream for this long. I stream for about four hours on average. Well, not just on average, but I stream like that long every day that I stream. Oh, I didn't put necklaces in here. Yeah. Excellent. Wait. Where's Foxy at, weight wise? Where's our tag at? 15.4. 15.4, you got six more ounces. Where's the tag at? It's not in here. Did that one not have a tag because we didn't have a name for it? Did I, did I not name this? No, you didn't. Ushi, 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 ushi. I'm going to weigh both your bags. And I'm going to tell you your total. This bag is named Bougie Bitch. You're at one. Eleven. Easy. <laughs> Country. Holy cow, you still alive. I know. You paid for it so you wouldn't forget. Thank you. Uh, I'm going to get everything boxed up. I'm going to go straight 
I'm going to go to the post office Saturday morning. Cool. So like Foxy? everything like should be ready to go Saturday. And then I'm going to tell you guys right now, because we have a foot of snow and we're supposed to get more on Monday, which is why I'm going on oh. Saturday. Okay. Uh, next week is going to be rough getting stuff to the post office. So if you want it, like soon, soon, then take so care of stuff now so that I can get there by Saturday. Foxy, this does not have a partner. It is a, what is this called, Mom? What? This back. It's a screw back. So this is a screw back. But yes, go on to here. <laughs> this is probably the prettiest plastic flower I've seen. I got this one. I've been helping this one. My right leg video. Right? right? We're freaking miserable over here. It doesn't, Lucy. That's why I was showing it to Foxy. That's why I was saying it doesn't have a partner. But it's one of the prettiest flowers I've seen out of all the things we found. Oh my gosh. I just know Foxy's been looking at flowers. And you can pop that back right off, and you can make this into something else. Um, Foxy just said they'll take the leaf earrings. So those leaf earrings? These? Yep. Um, missing, there's a stud missing. They're missing one of the diamonds. So if you ever get like a, just a regular diamond set of earrings, you can put them right to these holes. But it's only got one, but that's what they're supposed to look like. She said yes, no. Hey, weigh this real quick. Fifteen point eight. Yep. Excellent. Uh, we have some other flower earrings right here too. This bag is called Hoops for Days because that's what's in it. Hoops for Days. This one's mismatch. Those ones are. The sun earrings, these? Lucy, are you talking about these? Oh, dangly diamond shape was Foxy and the sun earrings with the pearls. Dangly diamond shape, these, which are very nice, Foxy. Are you talking about these? That's what I asked her. Bottom. Oh, these? These are the ones that Lucy wants. These are Foxy. These are clips, Lucy. These are clip-on earrings. These are earrings. Those are earrings. Blue stone flower earrings. These? These aren't blue, these are black. Okay, so flower, flower, gold roses. She said, oh, even better. So you want those black ones I just showed you? The black with the gold? <coughs> Clip flowers? Yes, in all the flowers. You want this one? This one is legit. It's almost the size of my ball. Lucy says yes and all the flowers. You want us just to put flowers in your thing until you're up to your next pound? <laughs> no. Lucy just said all the flowers. 
I just put flowers in this little thing so that Lucy could see them. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, all the flowers. Okay. Flowers. Oh, 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 oh. I'm pulling my mic off. Lucy without that the thing that she just took out of the bin. Those don't have matches. I know they don't. Okay. He had 3.5 more ounces. These all have burgers though. You don't want to put these in all the earring ones? Yeah, give me a second. I'll get there. What do we name this one? What are we naming this one? Lua is going to be the next one that's all earrings. Yep, it's coming up. Single Pringles. Single Pringle? Husband's talking to you. Husband's like, what are you doing? All right. Uh, let's do all, let's do the all earrings. We'll do all earrings for this one. So we have little gold knots. We have little silver hearts. Anybody like moons? Uh, we have little gold buttons. We have little gold bars. Oh, um, Foxy, you like purple? Tiny hoops. Here's a flower with a purple center. They are clip Pearls. Red centers. And then marquee rhinestones. What? Leather. Are these a no? Mm -hmm. Okay. Flower with purple. I'm doing, once again, one container at a time. Wait, the flower with the purple were supposed to go to me. These one? <laughs> a while ago. Okay. These ones were supposed to go to Lucy. Yeah, because she has the matching necklace. Okay. They've just been sitting in here. You know, she has spots. No, she has the matching necklace. They're supposed to be in there. I'm sorry, Lucy. I thought I put them in there. Oh, that makes me nervous. <laughs> I've tried to catch everybody. That makes me super nervous. These are all single earrings. None of these have matches. We have three little dangly hearts in gold. I feel like I've tried so hard, but I'm I'm sure I forgot something somewhere. You know what I mean? It's fine. I mean, I'm going to the card. These don't have matches. These don't have matches. These don't have matches. These blue ones are pretty. 
These don't have matches. Lucy said it's a lot to go through. Uh, Foxy said any more pendant items. I don't believe so. I think we've already gotten all of those boxes. Uh, the only, I have a pendant and um, matching leaf earrings in this little box right here. I have this set. Everything else is in bags. I can always pull something out of a bag if you really want me to. Whoops, 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 whoops. I forgot that pair of earrings right there. Oh, that's a pair of earrings. That's a, some thin ass hoop. Like, those are so useless. Would that box round me up to a pound? Probably. Well, they wouldn't be in the Pandora box. Oh, yeah, that's my Pandora box. But yes, that might, if you want them. They're very nice. It's a nice set. Yep. You're Yay, at one. Yay, you're at a pound. You're at a pound, Foxy. One pound, 0 0.09 ounces. Well, there's also this box in here. Mom. Hmm? There's also this box in here. Which you every time. I don't care if it's over. I, I want it to be over and not under. Over. <laughs> yeah, it's sold. Yay. Thank you so much for doing this with me, you guys. You don't even know. Like, this is the best. It was fun, okay, like I've had fun, but legit. Foxy said, happy to help get rid of some stuff for you, now off to bed. Seriously, legit doing this has been great. I appreciate you all. Oh, I'm gonna check your weight, Lucy. You're at 14.9, so you're at a pound 14.9. Years. Yeah, three more ounces left. All ears. Oh, uh, she just said are those sun earrings. These? These are so pretty. Those are the moon ones, and then there's these ones. These are so pretty. Yeah, I just showed those ones. Um... There's these pretty little 60 stars, which are cool. <laughs> There's these. These are marked, you have no idea how much, but these are marked. I just said I just wish I could have seen more of the things. West Germany. I'll take the moon and star earrings. <laughs> These are marked West Germany, and they're very cool. They're they're weird. Like I wouldn't wear them. Fifteen point six, Lucy. But they are very cool. Fifteen point six. Yeah. Point four ounces. What you gonna do with it? You want some big ass hashtag earrings? <laughs> oh, I'm sleeping in for sure, Foxy. Good night. The what? The West German ones. The West German ones? Sell them. Sell them. 
see if you can't make all of your money back from this entire night because then you're good. Well, both of yours together I think are at two pounds. Foxy has two, or yeah. Lucy. Lucy has two. Yeah. Are they at two pounds? She's slight. She's one ounce off. One ounce under. Sorry, gonna update my listing since I'm on the <laughs> Yes. Excuse me, please. Thank you. I got you. You want one more thing? <laughs> oh, You're one ounce away. You have one ounce. No pressure. If you're happy, I am happy. These are so cool. Did you guys see these? Lucy, didn't you? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, I need to understand what you're asking me to do. Update my listing since you've bought another bag. You bought two bags, right? Do you have three? No, Lucy has two bags. <laughs> it's correct, Lucy. I have you listed as one item for $40. That's two bags. Oh, and then we added another bag. Yeah, so she has a bag of... A I completely would have ripped package. myself off for 20 bucks just now, Lucy. You're so honest. Thank you so much. That's so nice. I just appreciate that so much. You don't even know. Gabby, what are you at? Gabby has four bags. And this one. No, Gabby has a flat four bags. Gabby, I just dropped my mic. Gabby has three bags and a partial. Lucy said I just want to be honest. Do you want to weigh them all? What am I at? Three point six. Three eleven. You're at three pounds eleven ounces, Gabby. So you got five more ounces to play with. To be fair, uh, this has not been put in a bag, Gabby. And it has matching earrings. Moved up to four bags. Put Miss Maybe's on my tab. It's a single tie tack. You're it's, killing me. Okay. It's not heavy. <laughs> Lucy, your listing is 55. I took $5 off for an honesty discount. Because <laughs> <laughs> I just appreciate the shit out of that. You don't even know. I have people trying to sneak stuff on me all the time like I'm dumb. You know what I'm saying? Honey, can you go back and look at that vase? Because I said this. Didn't happen. Right? So, hey, if I do this, can I get uh, something for free? I hear it all the time. You should have free self samples. Right? We should put that in stream first. You get a discount for being honest. Only one person gets it, and it only happens one time. To be fair, she could have just been like, oh, you're right. This is going to be extra heavy. We'll see how much that weighs. That feels really 
really, really heavy. Oh, I still have this Christmas bag. 1.1. I mean, one, one pound, 9.1 ounces. Okay, so I'm way, way the fuck over. Okay. Hang on. We're going we're gonna to divide this up. Careful. Take the heart, too. Okay. Was there any silver stuff? I have this whole bag of silver called Silver Bag One. So there's this one. It's on Etsy right now. It shouldn't be. Nobody's claimed it country. It's got some pretty cool shit in it, actually. Uh, and then there's this silver and beads one, which I'm going to be honest, I don't like as well. That's a cooler bag. I had a ton more gold than silver. But we do have one bag of silver that's up there. What is that? It's one pound, one ounce. Okay. What's this way then? One pound, one ounce. One ounce. Excellent. <laughs> Look at that shit. That's we did one. it. I don't care if they're an ounce over. I'm fine with that. I mean, if I hadn't done that, we probably could have got a whole other bag, but it doesn't matter. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Those are people's. Yep. I'm going to list this separately. Two separate listings. <sighs> I have 17, 17 listings. And what are we doing with this Emmons belt? Seven, 17 plus people. Huh? No, that's, that's regular listings. Add the silver bag. To country stash. Be careful though. Don't hit her. Oh, she's got room in her box. But don't hit her soap. This is Gabby. No, that's country. Yeah, thank you. Black beaded necklace. In here, what black beaded necklace? Which black beaded necklace? The one with the hand painted roses on it? This one? In the silver beads bag? This one? I got you. Okay. Yeah, I can sort this out. Hang on. You want this one, right? With the flowers on it? Okay. This is at 15.1 if I take this out. Huh? This is at 15.1 if I take this out. We'll leave it in there. I was going to make that one a pound. This will still be a pound. It's way over. Okay. Yeah, these are fine. Yeah, it's it's a pound, four ounces. It's fine. These are all way over. I can... It's fine. Um, where's Lucy's? I love it, I love it. Show it more. It's really pretty. Is that Lucy an ounce off? What are you at now? <laughs> It shouldn't be too much higher. There you go. One you're point. One point one one. So you're good. Oh. Two pounds, one ounce. 
I mean, you also have all the cameos in there, which is different, but. Time to sleep, right? It's midnight, y'all. It's, it's midnight. It's a new day. You know what we're going to do now? We're going to go the fuck to bed. Burn this room. That's what we're going to say. Look at the cat. We're going to bed. She looks so angry. Everybody should hear that in Samuel L. Jackson's voice, by the way. Go the fuck to sleep. <laughs> uh, for the first time ever, I'm not even going to raid anybody. I'm just going to go to bed. God, you guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me. Like, this is a long time. I appreciate you so much. This took forever. To be fair, the jewelry was your longest stream. Mm -mm. Yes, it was. It's only nine hours and nine 20 Nine hours minutes. plus the two and a half from yesterday. Oh, well, yeah. It wasn't two and a half yesterday. It was four. Not the whole... You weren't doing jewelry the whole stream. Oh, that's true. Okay. <laughs> okay, I love your faces. Nope, and nope, nope, nope. I will see you um, on Monday. I know you're stupid. I will get all of this stuff listed um, tomorrow after I wake up after sleeping late. I did do other stuff first yesterday. Um, so I'll get I'll get Etsy all sorted in the morning with all of these extra bags that we made, and um, then I will get everything uh, packaged up and taken to the post office on Saturday. If you are not concerned about getting it rapidly, <laughs> then you can wait until after then. But I'm going to tell you, it's going to take a minute because, like, snow apocalypse is a thing, okay? All right, love your faces. Hope to see you guys on Monday, or I'll see you around Twitch. Okay. <laughs>